What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's the Column Tiro Podcast. I'm your host, the big muscly boy. <laughs> the boy, the muscles. Dude, that don't even work out. That's I just mean, straight couches and cabinets. Those just, are, dude, that's just hanging out. There's dude. a couple of lethal weapons. For a guy who just hangs out, I'm not doing that. Is that Mel Gibson and Danny Glover? I should. I, every now and then, we do have weights over the outside of the room that I, I, I lifted like once or twice. I went, dude, I'm killing it. <laughs> <laughs> then I never got around to it again. I haven't properly worked out in fucking in years. Yeah, I'm like two years of just. I keep saying next week I'm running out of bed, dude. I had a, I, I literally paid six hundred or seven hundred dollars last year for a membership that I never went to. I went twice <laughs> and then never went. I went and then I canceled my membership and I realized it was six sixty five dollars a month. I was like, what? What the? <laughs> I thought hell? it was forty. Yeah, that's insane. I'm I'm Planet Fitness. I'm down. going Planet Fitness as soon as I get back from this fucking this European tour. I'm not a god to plan finish. Anyway, welcome to the Calm Tarot Podcast, boys. We've got uh, Jordan Jensen on our way in here later on today. Um, she's probably a few minutes away. Um, she's coming up. But listen, if you want to support the podcast, head over to patreon.com slash column Tyrrell. Please. Um, you get two extra episodes a week. Plus, you get all the back catalog of all our other previous work. Um, plus, you get opportunities to uh, ask questions that we read out on the podcast. And at the end of every single month, we do the live Collies um, Sunday service. Um, which is over Zoom. So, you know, help support the podcast. Be a real one. Go join the crew. Because uh, everything you hear right now, because we have advertisements, we, we, you know, we don't go in the paint, which, I, which I'm not quite sure what that means. But I, I know it definitely suits this, what I mean. It's close. It is. I'm, I'm, we be in You're the close. paint. Uh, dude, I'm always in the paint. You're in the paint. Is he going hard? Not on YouTube. On Patreon? Yeah. Patreon, Patreon, we're going fucking Patreon, hard in Patreon, the paint. Patreon, we say fucking slurs. Yeah, it's a Waka Flocka song on the Patreon. Yeah. <laughs> we, we, You're yes. getting K-pop on YouTube. Dude, it's a pure Nico act. It's, it's absolutely. It's, they're in the works. Dude. We've been indicted several times. It's a little edgy, uh, uh, edgy time edgy time boys club, dude. It's a federal case at this point. It's just edgy boys fun time on the Patreon. A couple of edgy lords. Yeah, so head over there. Join the crew. Be part of the fucking, be part of the movement. Yeah, and oh, subscribe oh. on YouTube if you're watching. Why not? You're already here. Hit the subscribe button. Twenty k subscriptions. Kali T taking us out for a nice steak dinner. I treat you too well, but um, thank God you guys don't <laughs> sell it that well. You're not very. You're not great sellers. So we're slowing it down. Coming's for closers. Coming is for coming is for closers for sure. <laughs> um. Come, maybe that, maybe David, if I if I brought you out for a nice calm dinner, David would be suddenly every episode going, Go! Subscribe! <laughs> Dude, overnight. The sound he, drop! He would have some sort of bots. He would have a fucking 8,000 bots. He would pay, he would pay. A thousand, farm in India. He would pay, a, yeah, some Saudi Arabian bot farm that usually mine crypto. You would use to subscribe to the podcast so you can get yourself a nice hot calm dinner. Dave Love For one Dude they, No he got the chef It uh, comes table it's, it's a tasting table mm. seven, It's all the sous chefs And bus boys Seven, seven courses of cum For David And A cum salmon yay Oh yeah Dave He's like, I'm thinking a little black thing, uh, Fertile you know, crescent It's just different plates But it's all just the same cum There's no It's all the exact same And he's like pretending same Like a, Oh do you get the oak I'm like dude It's all cum dude It's, it's got it, more of an oaky sensation to it I'm thinking he was a lumberjack yeah, for sure. That's the way Dave. Dave's very snobby about his cum. Yeah, when we all eat cum, we're just yeah, like it's high end cum. I don't know. Yeah, it's like it's like we're like we're like scumbags ordering wine. Whatever. Give me red. Yeah, give, give me your give me your cheapest cab. Whatever. No, I don't pasta. get oak right now, Dave. And Dave is like, "Don't you get that? Do you get a little bit of blood?" And I'm like, "Jesus, Dave Christ, fucking hell, fucking hey, dude." Dave goes, <laughs> "Yeah." <laughs> and he and he like, he leans over to the spit cup and goes. <laughs> Spit! <laughs> he goes. I'm sorry. I know I'm not supposed to swallow. Oh, it's so good. It's going right to my head right now, David. Come, Cagiano, Cagiano, <laughs> Mister Come, Mister Come, dude. Christ. Whatever. You're Mister Come. Everyone has their nicknames. I'm fucking El Toro Loco. This is Fonzie, and you're the, the you're you're the Come Lord, dude. Your your nickname is uh, you're Come Dumpster. Come Lord, Mister Come. <laughs> The comster. <laughs> come at the king, you better not miss. That's what they call you. You come on the king. <laughs> better shoot in his mouth. If you come on the king. Uh, sorry, David. You know, I apologize. But what are you, why are you showing them a random Google page right now? Why are you about to Google come? 
What were you doing? What were you <laughs> shoveling? It was a recipe for hot comb. <laughs> <laughs> Fred, That's the Cabanera mean, recipe, David. David, you guys yeah. are using eggs? <laughs> just one of the uh, fucking Jamie Oliver, you know, because Jamie's office calls him my wibbly wobbly cumders, you know, my cumsticles. Jamie Oliver? How'd you, you don't know Jamie Oliver? He's one of the most famous chefs in the world. He's an English guy. English dude? They call, yeah. his, they, they call them chef? Yeah. Gordon Ramsay? Okay, I like Gordon he's, Ramsay. He's Scottish, but, you know. Ah, well, he's Scottish, yeah. Oh, yeah, of course you knew the difference, of course. Of well, course, I of mean, course. golf or fucking but Jamie Oliver, beans. I mean, Jamie Oliver would make you stuff, like, instead of just instead of just being, like, you know, French toast, it's always called my, uh, my, cub, <laughs> my amazing. <laughs> yummies. Yeah, well, it was, like, totally flipping awesome French toast, you know? That's right, what he, right. It was always called flipping awesome French toast, you know? And right. That's the same. If he, a little flair he puts on it. He would just name shit stupid shit. Pretty fucking good. Good chef. Have you had his, his stuff? I've made his stuff sometimes. Yeah. Okay. I've never okay. got the one of his chefs. He's just a TV chef. I can't imagine you in a kitchen, like, getting real into a... Oh, no, I'm a nerd. I'm a a, nerd. I get into everything I do. I'm a nerd. I just, I just, I just ran out of time once, and I was like, "I'll cook next week." And I haven't cooked. <laughs> yeah, it's been seven years. It's been nah. It's it's certainly since the pandemic ended. Right. Yeah. right. Once I once I started working, I was like, "Fuck that." Yeah, I'm a takeout. Every whore, now and again, my girl's like, "You don't like you used to make me this." I'm like, "There's nothing going on." <laughs> of course, I was gonna do girly shit. It's fucking bored. <laughs> <laughs> I was like making roast. Yeah, I'm, I'm a fucking. You make a roast, dude. Oh, dude. Of course, that's all the what Irish, the dude. That's all the Irish. That dude. that is definitely the best. Though. Well, which is so funny because everyone's like, like Thanksgiving dinner is literally just like that's just like a regular meal, like. We also eat like that for, um, you guys eat like fucking pilgrims because uh, you were the pilgrims. We had the the OGPs, yes. OGP, yeah, yeah. you know me. <laughs> I don't know what that means at all. OPP, never. You don't know what OPP is no. that, that song. No. You down with OPP? Yeah, you know me. Who's down with OPP? Yeah, Every you last know me. lady. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what yeah. OPP stands for? I wish for? I was a little bit taller. I wish I was a baller. I wish I had a bitch and I would call her. Different song, but still. Cut that out. Don't let that. Don't let that be aired. Cut that out. Write that down. I used to sing that on my way to basketball practice. What? I wish I was a little bit taller. I'm or sure, when I got I'm cut sure. from you the still, team. You probably still sing. I mean, I could I could use a couple inches, but I got them where they count. Oh, yeah? Not in your brain, because you're retarded. Dumb as hell. But yeah. dick? It's okay. Jesus Christ. Don't ever do that on a podcast. Don't ever talk about your okay dick. It's okay. That's crazy. That's crazy. Don't ever, don't ever be like the, everyone listen. Went, oh fuck that guy. That's mm, a bad. Look. Already done. It is it. a bad, bad look to be the guy who's like, yo, I got a big dick. That's a horrible look. No one likes that. It's actually repulsive. The behavior is horrible. I'm sure your dick is fine. This is on YouTube. I got to cut the last two minutes now. Because <laughs> now, because 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 you you're... came at me. Now I got a weird, awkward sweat no. going on. <laughs> I'm melting right here, right now. I'm trying my Yo, best to I look cool. I thought it was cool. <laughs> I said I thought with the height and the inches, but where they count, and then you're going. No, nah. no, nah, you got to You got to be the officer. You go. I'm Whatever. short king, but my dick doesn't look as small now because I'm small. My dick's all fucked up looking, but we didn't get into love. Is it? Is it? <laughs> Me and Harvey Weinstein hanging out at our little ugly dick club. What was his dick about? What was going on there? Oh, I remember there was I an feel article like I, recently. I, yeah, but I feel like they're just roasting them now. I feel like they're not even. Well, they did it to Jeffrey Epstein too. Remember they like, like the DA was like reading a description. He's like, and the defendant described his penis as weirdly Wait, like, egg-shaped we... looking. Yeah. What? Sorry. I thought I saw something on the ground. It doesn't matter. I didn't say that. I'm, my mind's playing sugar. They said uh, that's F another '90s hip hop uh, song FC's, reference. FC's cock is egg shaped, right? Yeah, they said it was like weird egg shaped, like the fucking. What a life to be Epstein! I was watching a little bit of uh, Epstein last night. I, I happened to walk into the kitchen or, or into, into the living room while there was a little bit of Epstein going on. A little bit of Epstein on the TV. Mm -hmm. I'm not really into it. I don't like it. More of a hip hop guy. But there was some Epstein on the TV. <laughs> um, there was some Epstein on the TV, so I watched. And uh, what a what what a what an exciting life, you know? Like I don't know if you ever like the 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 little the 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 thrill you get from a the smallest little misdemeanor. You know what I'm saying? Like, do you ever like just be you know a self scan out? Self checkout, commit a little petty theft, just lob a little banana in your pocket or whatever. Usually, you know, those those M and M's, you know, two bags of M and M's, swiping one, whatever. But, you know, and you're kind of like, Ugh. now imagine running a pedophile empire. <laughs> imagine that feeling. 
No, like honestly, the 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 weight, the weight. That's Jeffrey. Jeffrey, a brilliant man. No, I don't condone his behaviors, but you got to say that is a brilliant man. He is a he's a he really he really hustled dude, his way to the top. Dude, you would have slept out all of those massages with the kids. There's no way you could have been the next Jeffrey Epstein. You wouldn't have the punctuation to be the next Jeffrey Epstein. The, the punctu- punctuation? Yeah. Yeah. To 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 have a massage be, from a 15 year old? Like to be on time? Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Yes, that's what punctuation. <laughs> Yeah, that's punctuality. They oh. don't laugh like I'm the dummy. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> I tried to double down on you, and I was like, well, I, I can't even think of the words. We're just going to roll with it. Oh, yeah, sorry. But you wouldn't have the punctuality. Cut that. Flip that. This is going to be a butchered episode. I mean, we're fucking just scatterbrained right no. now. But yeah, but the, but in terms of just even the logistics, you know, Jeff, uh, uh, what, what was it good? G- Giselle? Whatever they were. Giselle. G- Giselaine. Giselaine. Whatever fucking fucked up name she had. Uh, oh, Jeffrey! She was out getting all these girls, bringing them up to the house. He was Scoping getting, them. he was getting wanked. Mm-hmm. Crazy amount of wanks. That's wild. How many wanks he was getting a day? He was, <laughs> he was just constantly getting wanked. How can massaged you massaged and wanked like hourly? It's crazy. The richer you get, the more free time you have to just be like, I'm, like that was part of his daily routine was to get like four or five wanks a day, exclusively by like fourteen year olds. Yes, and then at one point you go like, is that what he's into? Or is he? Or is he just like what? Did, then he was trying to get other pedophiles to fuck those girls, right? Well, he successfully did. He would coerce them into a, a life stuff from that, like that. Well, from my understanding, it's like people would go there like just for like an average party, and then like when like the real party would start late at night, it would just be like Jeff, you would bring oh just, just girls just start coming out of nowhere, and like these guys probably didn't know like you know ages specifically. I mean, you gotta fucking be able to tell Bill Clinton what are you doing? They yeah, the Bill, Bill is Bill has bad eyesight. We're gonna you know, get Bill, suicided, Bill, Bill dude. Has- <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get found with three yeah. three self inflicted yeah. gunshot wounds. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm kill myself. I stab myself in the back. Yeah, thirty times. Hit myself with a hammer in the back of the head. <laughs> yeah, like multiple times. Absolutely. But I'm just saying, the, like, look, I'm not. I'm, not, I'm listen, obviously. I'm just saying, the the there's a lot of these guys who are are not good guys. But when you look at the work ethic, you go, man, most people wouldn't have been able. Most there's a lot of people who want to be Jeffrey Epstein, who are like sicko pedophiles and want to be in that world, but they just don't actually have the abilities. Don't have the resources. They don't have the charm to like <laughs> meet people at parties. They don't invite Chris fucking Tucker to your island. They ain't coming. You gotta have a schmooze. The fourteen year olds there. <laughs> oh my god! And there's not, then I ain't going. He goes, You gotta go to this party, Jackie! Lee! Last time the 12 year old, everyone went to bed and then he brought out 14 year olds, Jackie! <laughs> uh, yeah, exactly. So that's the, the way it is. I'm just saying. Uh, but then I guess just, but what was going on? So he would, but he would then use this as blackmail, right? Well, that's the idea is that all these people would go there. So right, here's what happened, right? First of all, it was he into, was he even into little girls wanking him off? Or yeah, was that yes, more like a thing he yes. just had to do? He loved that. He loved it. So he was a pedophile. Yeah. For wanks. He was a wank. He was a wank pedophile, which is like so baffling to me. Yeah. I feel like a wank's a wank. It's like the rub and tug. Like, what do you Why would you get a wank off? I'm sure or? he was doing now. Nah, he definitely was having that's sex That's the sure. craziest thing. I can't even imagine. I feel like. A wank to me from a fourteen-year-old and an eighteen-year-old, it, it would everything's the same here, except I'm breaking the like. It doesn't make sense why I wouldn't be able to just be like, give me the eighteen. You know what I'm saying? But cracking them open, that has to be a huge difference. <laughs> I'm not into that. I'm just saying, like, I'm saying you can't you can't crack open these chicks. It, it's different. A wank is a wank. It's a wank. Is a wank. 80 years old, 40 years old, 14 years old. It's all the same. So that's like a weird thing. Sure. Right? Right. I'm not crazy here. It's good timing. No. <laughs> Here's Jordan Jensen. Hey, Jordan. You look great. Really? No. But I like to um, be nice to the guests when they come on. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, go do your thing. So we're, we're just talking about Epstein's cock. Can I jump in here? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Look, come on in. Walk in. Have fun. So, but I'm just saying, she'll have she'll have my back here. That door's gonna open up in a second, and I don't want to be screaming about the fucking. 
So is cock. <laughs> Listen, a fourteen, a wank off a fourteen-year-old. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! Daughter- I was in the back of my brain, was just begging you to stop. Why? Stop it! You don't know. No. You you get no. you get. I think you kind of have a thing for something. You 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 get too caught up when we talk talk about pedophiles. Dude, I'm too much of a patriot, dude. That's what's to what? going on. I'm- to say to say that I said it's crazy to get a wank from a fourteen-year-old. That's what I said, and no. you looked at me going, "No, that's great." I go. Have you ever given it a shot? I, I'm saying <laughs> there's not a part of my brain that can rationalize wanting to get a hand job off a 14 year old. You were saying it is the same as getting a hand job from an 18 year old. I'm that's not going to. That's what I'm, I'm saying. Not gonna, I'm, 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 it yeah, is the same. Yeah, so why would you go? About this. Why would you go through it? Why would you go through the effort of getting a 14 year old when it's illegal? Because it's, it's about creepy. control. It's about power. Now we're talking. It's about, about influence. Well, then why not just fucking fuck our? <laughs> well, no, that's that's why you did it. He definitely was. It would just start like, like, like that's how he would like procure them. It'd be like, hey, this guy, old man, he has money, he wants to help you out. He just needs a massage after school, and, and we'll give you six hundred bucks. And then you start doing that. Six hundred. That's that's what one lady said. That's a lot. But then it brings them back in, you know, because you would go for like poor, like they'll you get, know, underprivileged you go, girls. Get you gobble up. They, they, and a lot of a lot of uh, Florida girls went missing. A lot of the young girls around that end went missing. Did you know Ghislaine had her submarine license, dude? <laughs> <laughs> What are you? What are you even getting at now? Dude? It's just a what, funny what, thing to me. It's what just a fucking four chan site where That's you are, you and the boys talk about, dude. Somewhere, do you ever heard of Lost City of Atlantis? <laughs> That's the original Epstein under. Island, that's dude. an underwater. That was Epstein Little Saint James. Lyric. Someone close the door, will you, please? The Disney cruise used to make stops there too. By the way, the Disney cruise. Disney what? cruise used to make stops at Little Saint James. I'll tell you this though. Um, it's just little tidbits. I don't have the whole picture, but I got little tidbits. I I, I can only give you a glance into it. Um, you know my my sister, um, she fucking Oculus. Put it on, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta escape yeah. this reality, dude. It's too dark, dude. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm six foot two, and, I'm my, fucking, and my cock is six. I'm inches. fucking point guard on the 76ers, dude. <laughs> <laughs> with a tiny cock, <laughs> with the tiny cock, with the tiniest cock on Broad Street, dude. I don't know, but I'm just saying, my my my, you know, my sister lived in the Virgin Islands, of course. And uh, I asked her when I saw her, I go, Yo, did you ever hear of Epstein when you're out there? And she goes, She goes, she literally goes, Who the fuck is Epstein? Well, so, no one knew who he was till like. No, but yeah. I, I, you, oh, you think you're after all that at the time in that part of the world, you think they would have um, had been like, oh, hey, man, don't go near the Peter don't Island, go near man. That island. Yeah. Oh, you like my watch? I helped out Jeffrey Epstein, man. Oh, wow. It's like a talk show now. It's kind of like that talk show. It's just hey, a, welcome Jordan Jensen. Welcome to the Colin Terrell talk show, everybody. Build that wall. Whoops. Uh, Look at this. You paint this wall? Uh, I was like that before. I, I painted these walls when we moved in here. I'm gonna build a wall in here. That was that. Uh, I just I have literally just can't be asked. Yeah, she was trying to help. Remember last time I know, she was I here? Know, I know. I, I thought we worked well. it all out. There we was... did. We did work it yeah. all out. I just haven't got around to it. It's doing. so hot in here. It's unbelievable. Is it really Every that time, hot? Yeah, it's awful. We just had the, the AC. whole building's insane. No, the bathroom is perfectly cool. Is we'll it? crack the window in there. But you know, it is what it is. We can't open the window. What's what wrong you... with your voice? Uh, it's my TV. I'm on TV. Oh, voice. gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Hey, welcome. Ladies Man, welcome after I saw you last night, mm. did you see what happened in the bar? No. I oh, like, at, like in the other room? Yeah. Oh, because you left and came back or something, though, did you? I did a spot at McDougal, and then I came back to do a spot at the bar. And then were you up there to see me bomb? Were you watching me bomb up there in the balcony? Well, last night was like insane. No, I wasn't in the balcony. Oh, thank God. Last night was insane. <laughs> there was like... A, a, I killed that I did crush. the whole Hasidic Jew joke, and then half the audience was Hasidic Jews. And we got into a whole argument. Who did? You and the, you and the and boys? The Jews. You and the Jews? Yeah. I know the bar. On Sunday. It's, the men are fine. It's the women. What that was are going on? Was, was, was Ryan Long there? <laughs> huh? Was Ryan Long there? They love Ryan Long. Why? I have no <laughs> idea. He doesn't know either, but he, they, he is a huge. Curly. The men love me. The women hate me. The women have dragged me on the internet for that Hasidic Jew joke. And I told us, and this woman goes, boo. Uh, and I was like, are you a Hasidic Jew? And she was like, yes. And then everybody got all weird and woke because of the whole Jewish and Kanye thing. And now everybody's on. And, and I was like, okay, how about this? Gay people. And she's like, we love gay people. And I was like, okay, my moms are lesbians. Are they going to hell? And she was like, well, maybe we shouldn't get into this. And I was like, <laughs> well, of course. Oh. See? But uh, did, did the crowd go, fuck the Jews? They, or did, they, they, they were they, on my side. They were on your side? Yes, yes. But it was mm. tough yeah. for a minute there. What the are they, is what I they doing? What are they doing out of their neighborhoods? What are they doing out of their neighborhoods? Shouldn't they be fucking rolling like a, a 
the fucking wheel with a stick or whatever. This is their name. They own everything. We are in their neighborhood. Jews? Yeah. You better be careful with that. Nah. What do you mean? In Williamsburg? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, flying. It's like they, they own everything. They whoa, own whoa, whoa, whoa. They own most of, uh, you know, New York City. <laughs> that is fair. Um, that is fair. Most uh, follow the money. I even made fun follow of the their money. how bad follow they are the in carpentry. Too. I really went in. <laughs> oh yeah, like oh, they're bad, bad carpenters. Like they're bad landlords. I couldn't stop. It was bad. bad I landlords. might get in trouble. Off who? SD. For being too uh, anti-Jew. Uh, oh, I mean, I was fully anti-Semitic. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, there goes our monetization. Is it anti-Semitic to just say you hate the Jews and the rats? Is that bad? Yeah. Well, yeah. that's not America. I don't I hate the it. Jews. All my friends are Jews. Hasidic Jews I have a particular problem with because they always yes. try and hit me. They hit you? Yeah, they get very close to killing me multiple times. Many times. Oh, well, because when you're on your Look little... Look with their Because they uh. pray while they drive and I'm on a motorcycle. They are not praying yes, while they, they drive. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. They have to the pray. The curly ones? Yes. No. Well, got that's license. why they drive <laughs> insanely. They're always texting on their little T9 phones. They are always phones, texting. They're always praying. praying. They have a little flip... <laughs> yeah, they have a little flip phone. That's because they're not allowed to have phones newer than that it's because their police they have their own police force who yeah. pulls them over so nobody pulls them over they have their own hospital force remember black kid got left in the street remember well, uh, well, well, where were the parents that's what i oh asked. yeah we were, we've had this debate we had this debate kanye needs you like as a concierge type. Uh, it's bad it's bad i wish i was half jewish so i could get away with this shit so much. we could just claim it okay they don't really jewish. know yeah you can yeah you, you could come up yeah you have a jewish vibe -ish. but i got off stage and the hasidic <laughs> men were like that was good that was very good. We yeah. love that. <laughs> very pleased. I was yes. laughing with my family about you going in and turning off their lights and them giving you challah and, Bread. You, and you thinking it was like this grand gift. And then I showed a picture of it for like one ninety nine in the supermarket to you. Yeah, well, it wasn't like, fresh. Fuck. It wasn't fresh out the oven. The marble though, rye. It? <laughs> it was. Yeah, <laughs> yeah they just the, heated oh, it up. Oh, I got some Jewish wonder bread. <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I've been in the Jew this house. This is how I, this is now? This is the way it is, yeah. That's insane. Why Isn't don't you just get insane? a throne and make us sit on the floor? Yeah, some people come in with big attitudes about it. Yeah, right. for sure. That's for cool. sure. I get it. You're blown up on Instagram. It's, it's Has it, I'm not blowing up on Instagram. I, it's slowed down. <laughs> also, you can't. It, that whole bubble's going to burst. It's not real. Oh, no. I think bad crowd work will be popular forever. Excuse me. My <laughs> crowd work is not bad. <laughs> <I didn't, laughs> Did you see the thing Amy posted being like, stop posting crowd work videos? No. Shanka? No. Amy, the booker at, or the old booker of New York Comedy Club. No, we don't bring her up. We don't talk about her. Okay, great. But we can talk about it. What's so the book? What she say? Stop posting crowd work. Mm -hmm. Why don't you work out about getting a job, Amy? Why don't you find a job? Does she have a job? I guess that's her job now. <laughs> criticizing crowd work. Yeah. We can all do that. <laughs> it's just so Find weird. Your own name, you're, like, it's, you're like it's helping people that you've like incubated for years of get course. work. Yeah. Why are you against this? Well, I'm not. I'm not against anything to uh, forty forty year career, career. Really. I think I'm literally going to have a lot of a podcast behind Patreon where I get my asshole bleached. I'm like, we're doing anything for comedy. We'll do. I mean, for yes. money. I wish I wish it was for comedy. <laughs> That's kind of that is funny. Five dollar tier. It's gonna be not great. Bad. It's gonna be great. <laughs> what do you? I, they're not for gonna that? show my asshole, but they'll show me. Just getting bleached. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wax. You know what I mean? Wax is no. Oh, you, <laughs> you got luck going down there. Oh no! I, I'd get I waxed a, for a fucking. I would do it. What do you guys think about the landing strip? I feel like it's trashy, like a rat tail of the vagina. Home yeah, school. Oh, yeah, it looks like a like homeschooler. Yeah. Like, like, right? Like I got a rat tail right bit? now. You do? Like, yeah, I've got it's a haircut. It's good on a so head. Far. Like a little. Nice. That's not a real you thing. You guys though. always think it's rat tails when it, when it grows out like that, but it's not. You know okay, what every guy should do is the Australian mullet. You almost did it. Yeah. Well, I, yeah. What's, what's the Australian mullet what's compared this? to like... It's just a ratty mullet, I think. It's the it? Australian soccer player mullet. It's what's his face has it. Is it like Theo? The... Theo Vaughn. Okay, yeah, yeah. Nah, Theo's is nice. Isn't like Theo a... looks so much like a tiger cub. It's crazy. He looks not like a man at all. No, yeah. that yeah, no. That's fucking gnarly. Right in yeah. soccer mullet. Australian soccer player. Uh, it's <laughs> like like all like the seventeen year olds run around like with. Yeah, mullets are back. They're back. Do you, hard. do you guys know what no Have cap you... means? Yes. Oh, are you kidding me? That's not like, we don't. We don't even use that joke around here. We don't even cap. But that's mean? gone. We, we stopped. We, we don't we, cap. We're, we're not even. You said, what does it derive from? Cap. I don't know where. Oh my god. I, well, that's what I'm asking. I don't know oh. where. It oh, you want to derive the, from? I, I'm not. I guess. Tell you what I'm it not, means. I'm not, I'm not, I know what neighborhood it came out of. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> It's, it's yes. definitely. <laughs> it did, it, it's originally from rap. It's from I know Atlanta. It from rap. It's definitely yeah, like an Atlanta And then it got thing. appropriated. But I just was wondering what it actually comes from. No, we say yeah, type no cap. No. We don't. We go no way, type B. No cap in this studio. Or the I think it would be funny if it was no caps, like no caps lock. 
I love he's reading through tweets to try to find a photo of a mullet. The it's phrase cheap. no cap is used to emphasize. Oh. <laughs> Look at, see? Good. Everybody, you know him, you love him. We are, of course, talking about sheath underwear. My balls touch nothing other than um, sometimes my girlfriend's chin. Um, sometimes they'll, they'll rest on the toilet seat when I'm having a shit. Um, but nine times out of ten, they are rubbing against sheet underwear. They're the only underwear that I wear these days. And the best thing about sheet underwear, if you do not know, they are designed with a special compartment within the underwear for you to separate your nuts and your cock. Because what happens is when those two boys are rubbing against each other, imagine your hands. Imagine just holding hands like this. For so, if you're listening, just imagine holding hands, all right? Yeah, and so you hold hands. You ever hold hands with someone for too long? It gets kind of hot and sweaty, and it's like, ugh, you kind of gotta rub your fucking your palms against your chest to dry it off. That's what your cock and your nuts are doing all day. It's just a pool of horrible, uh, unhygienic mess down there. Um, and that's why every time you whip out your nuts to get a blowy, she, she kind of goes, ugh, God, the, the taste of vinegar. Not anymore, boys. Her tongue will have no vinegar after she sucks your dick. I promise you. They love it. I've been getting blowjobs five, six times a day since I sometimes have to take sheet off because I'm getting too many blowjobs. So if you want to be cool and get your fucking cock sucked like the way I do, a real cool dude, go to sheetunderwear.com. Use the promo code Collie, C-O-L-L-I-E, and get 20% off your first order. Every order comes with sheets 100% money back guarantee. That's sheetunderwear.com, promo code Collie, C-O-L-L-I-E. Get Sheet Underwear and let them support your balls. Yeah, so there you go. That's what you think is, yeah. It's not like it's a guy. pretty hot. And it's you gotta, a half mohawk, half mohawk. You, you got to do it yourself. Yeah. You, you can't be going, getting paid. You just do it one night when you're drunk at a party and go, this is what I do now. You just buzz the side off. Yeah. yeah, it's a it's a it's a business up front. Wait, that's a perfect one. Far far right. Oh no, it disappeared. Yes, in the middle. This guy. Yeah. No, that's what you like. Yeah. No, boo, boo. You need to have the fucking ponytail. Yeah, it down. should go longer. But it's that is go, a good. That's like, just a bad haircut. No, yeah, that's like a fade. Yeah, it's too much like a fade. I agree. No, that's the one I'm talking about. This guy. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he's just a hot guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a Viking. Right, right, right. That's like that's like when you see a girl totally. like <laughs> at a bar. And you go, yeah. that's a great bar, dude. And you go, no, you yeah. saw a hot girl there once. Yeah. You got laid there once. <laughs> I've been I've been like that for fucking places in Dublin where I got, got pussy there once. You're gonna always like, oh, that's a great spot. I know. That it's like, like we gotta go back. We gotta go. I don't we have to go back. Yeah, people with their blackjack tables, they're like, "That's the one that's rigged. That's yeah. the one you got to go to. That one will get you fucking money." And you're like, "No, you won one time." Yeah, for sure. Well, that's the way. Well, and that's the same with that guy with that fucking mullet. I well, I just don't have the confidence to really grow out a mullet, man. I feel like I've you got, should. I, I yeah. How do you have the confidence to grow out whatever the fuck is on your face, but you can't do the thing? <laughs> well, I'm playing Damn. around. I'm playing around with it. I know. Play around with your hair, also. Nah, it's not the same. That I'm doesn't mullet, make any sense. You got a little alfalfa what? spike in the back. I was yeah, like, that's because of the uh, yeah. When you do it, is but yeah. that's not like a look that I'm going for. But I might <laughs> no. bring it back. Maybe that <laughs> should be spike. my thing. Yo, Single just, spike. Dude, everyone calls me Spike. Yeah, spike. I would do. It. If everyone called me Spike, I would change. <laughs> I would do whatever I can <laughs> yeah. to be called Spike. <laughs> you kidding me? I walk in, go, yo, Spike, and I go, ooh, wear like a dog collar. We can start calling you Spike. We can make that happen. Can I want to be called Chief. All right. All right, Chief. Okay, Chief. Can we make that happen? Great. I feel it's a, it's a, ma- it's a male. It's a male. I know. It's I, a male it, term. It's because I was thinking about it because I was stressing out about aging, and I was like, I think I just need to age into like a Native American chief. Mm. You know what I mean? As a woman. Like, you have yeah. to just become like a hawk lady. Yeah. Long, like gray braids. Well, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You yeah. can't hold on to youth at all. No. That's yeah. when it gets scary. You got to embrace your yeah. old age and give wisdom. You can't dye your hair ever. You got to just start giving Just put a wh- feather in yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. The grays, let the grays come out. Do a little salt and peppers, yeah. kind of hot. Yeah. And then let people go, you know what? Back in the day, I th- I'm sure she was a bit of a fox. Yeah, right, 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 right. A little right. silver fox. They have one. to let it go completely. I would crack open some old women if I go, you know what? Back in the day, she was a bit of a fox, I think. I crack into some old women is... Amazing. I said it's crack open some old women. Okay, yeah. okay. Either, either or. Either or, sign me up. Is, that's a shirt. That's a merch. We have merch that says crack open old women. Really? Yeah, we're, we're, we, we're, we, we hate ages on here. We love gilfs. On the column tour podcast. What's the oldest you fucked? I have no idea. I have no idea. I'd have to think 24, probably. <laughs> <laughs> Guess how old I am. <laughs> oh, God. A 24-year-old? Gross. No. <laughs> 22. There. Oh. Um, no, in fact, I fucked some old women over the course of my life. 
just happens. But like old, old, they're like not like crazy. I'll definitely ten years or plus, because ten years is like. I'm sure I banged some Tibetan. Who, who was who was seven? Tibetan. No, she yeah she she was 109. <laughs> seven but, years in Tibet. I think I'm sure she was 50s. Nice. But she looked she looked that's she, sick. I fucked up with in a guy good in his way? 50s. That's yeah. awesome. Yes, yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> Banging an old woman is awesome when that you're rules. when listen. Women are attractive as long as they're not your age. That's the that's, rule. <laughs> Right That's when you so when strange. you when depends, depends no. which way you go. <laughs> when you're thirty, a thirty year old woman is disgusting. You never. Uh, meet but when you're eighteen, like, oh. when you're eighteen, a thirty year old woman is just like, oh shit! Hell yeah! Wow, she's been to France. Wow. And then when you're <laughs> and, and now now it like, and like a forty five year old woman is hot, and I promise you, when I'm forty five, I'm like, wow, yeah. forty five. Like even I remember being twenty, like twenty year old women were all right. Now they're hot again. I've tried to get my mom to date women her age, and she like punches me. She's like offended by it. She what? Only she goes young. Oh my god, incredibly yeah, young, your younger mom than rules. me. Yeah. Oh really? Yeah, of yeah, course. Yeah. That's sick. Listen, it's, it's just it's 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 the best looking women at the young one. True. <laughs> on get them under eleven. It's great. <laughs> Ideal. <laughs> well, they're hairless still. You don't have to bleach their assholes. <laughs> yeah, they no come, landing strip. Well, they still have their factory settings. They're na- naturally got to hard reset them in the woman. I know what you mean. Naturally hairless sounds awesome. That's a good one. Yeah. It's like nair. It's permanent nair. Permanent nair. Have you ever used nair? You ever smelled that stuff? No. It's like intense sulfur, like rotten eggs in a tube. It's actually it's nasty. quite yeah, overwhelming. I imagine it being just super cancerous. Yeah. I just yeah. I don't know how that works. I used it back in the day on my nuts. Really? It's, a good, it's a good. It's good for your nuts. I feel like it'd be like putting icy hot in there. Just it, a nah, it just, it, just sort of, it just falls out in clumps. It's it's kind of odd because you go, is this working? And the whole it's thing really just, crazy. Yeah, yeah. I used it one time as like a thirteen year old on my legs, and it is mm. really fucked up. I no like, negative effects at all, which is deranged. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very strange. No negative effects? It has to burn. Can't that burn? It doesn't even burn. No, but, you just rub it on and then you're... Because I've heard of pranks where people put it in people's shampoo bottles or whatever and they put it in their head and their <laughs> hair falls out and they can't, can't grow back. Classic. Oh, it can't grow back. That's what I heard. Wow. But and that's the, fine for your legs. Who cares? Yeah, that's fine for your legs yeah. for sure. Yeah. But I did it on my nuts because your nuts, it's hard to clean your nuts like... Yeah. You gotta it's actually burden. It's a, it's crazy because there's so many techniques. You got to sometimes you got yeah, to do the Batman. Some people do it, yeah, they stretch yeah. it out, stretch it out. Yeah, and you get a an extra hand, you get an extra hand in there and whip out the fucking razor and go up and down. <laughs> yeah, I've clipped my nuts a lot over the years. Actually, the, genuinely, what's that product <laughs> we were fucking peddling for a while? Nair. The nuts, the nuts product. Product. Manscaped. Manscaped. Manscaped's fucking good. I'm not being paid right now to do that. Nanshape is solid. It's not. What like, is it? They're like a, it's a special design. It's a buzzer for your nuts. As like a better, it doesn't catch the skin. Oh, mm. because when you're clipping your nuts, you just all that. Fucking It'll just fuck. Excess oh. wrinkles is getting gobbled up there, dude. I freehand like you like free? I'm trimming like yeah, edges. Yeah. You, you do the pull and the twist. Yeah, you got to pull. You I'm twist, like I'm like twist. Mr. Miyagi yeah. with the fucking little bonsai tray. I also do the pull and <laughs> twist on the triangle. You got to do the pull and the pull twist. Pull and the twist. Yeah. So are you thinking about getting a strip? Is that what we? Ew! No, no, no. We were just talking about it. No one has a strip though. Really? It's outdated. No. What's that's, the, that's I've crazy. never seen one. I'm 24 and I've no. never seen one it's, yet. It's so maybe it's an older woman thing. I don't know. You've never seen a strip? No, no girls around my no, age are doing strips. the What do they have? What do they have? Full bush. Clean shaven or sometimes the whole bush administration. Like the whole thing? Like George, Barbara, All Jeb. natural? Yeah. Ugh. Around every- but I think insane. that was an accident. I think that was an accident. I think the girl, because even her friend was like, I'm surprised that they're hooking up because she was supposed to get her wax and she missed an appointment. So they're mostly- No, no, because like, no, uh, no, that's not, you can't, you fucking- That's what the girl you, said to my you, friend. That's I'm a saying. lie straight to your fucking dumb male face. She didn't say it to me. Because you can have too long, your pubes can get too long for a wax. No, this was like- Cause, No, because I know fucking long. someone who went to get wax and they're like, your bush is too much. I, I was surprised she fucked me. <laughs> I was like, this thing fucking like holding oh, it back. Oh my God. Getting the hair clip, pinning it up. Yeah, did you say I'm disgusting for thinking full bush is r- rotten? Full bush? What is a full bush? What about the triangle? Is that good? Triangle's fine. Sure. At least, but you prefer. It there. I don't even let my pubes grow out. So what the fuck? So are we you talking? prefer mm-hmm. nothing? Bald? I'm yeah. I'm 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 a, I'm a bald. I'm a bald guy. Yeah. Full bald. I mean, maybe I'm still a boy, but yeah. No, nah, that's just the way I. Was that's just the way there. it is. It's just for me. It looks so strange on women when it's you great. take their when yeah, they take their clothes off and it's completely bald. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's odd. It's awesome, dude. <laughs> it's like not as tan as the rest of their body. It's very strange. Yeah, it's definitely like it's been exposed. Yeah, early. <laughs> it's not <laughs> so, good. Too raw. 
for sure. Yeah, but I can got, see that. Angle. You need the triangle, but you can go hairy, not crazy hairy, but you still gotta Your make sure. Stubs up. I don't like... want to. I don't want any fucking hairs over the lips. You know what I mean? Oh yeah, you can't have that. That's, that's, I agree that's with that, that's but that's enough. uncomfortable. Just but again, I'm yeah, that's gonna like affect your day to day. Yeah, 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 for sure. All right, but some people are just like the older guys, were like because they grew up on the bush. They like that's their thing. Yeah, seventies like guy, seventies porn. Yeah, that's what they grew up or the magazines and all that type of shit. That's what they're like into. All someplace. they knew was bush. That's all they knew. Yeah, because they would catch a bit of bush. Seventies porn rules. Yeah, you think so? Oh my god. Yeah, the people are so tan and hot, and it's like very like peace and love, and everybody just yeah, it's good. Every both people are coming, and then you get into the eighties, and it's just chaos. Yeah, yeah. It's all yeah. Hair metal bands. nylon and just women <laughs> just choking down coke and cum. It's brutal. <laughs> and then you we're, get we're, into good night. We're so opposite. What do you watch? <laughs> I don't oh, you know, like, but you, you like what I'm saying, describing? Eighties yeah, yeah, sounds yeah. awesome. Yeah. I yeah. don't remember seeing anyone from the seventies being particularly too hot. Well, the, like pull it up. I guess, but like, the girls are always. They hot. have like ski outfits on. They're adorable. Yeah, but then it's just it's like kind of blurred. It's not blurred, but it's not good. It's not like good. No, it's not good footage. Yeah, oh. there you go. Look at that guy, Pleasant Cruise. Click that one, Pleasure Cruise. Look at these beautiful people enjoying each other. See, that's my must. That's the mustache I'm going for. That's, that's great. For. That truly that's, looks that's... like my mother and father when they were that age. <laughs> wow, <laughs> truly. That's incredible. How guys look you, at her bush. Look Harry at that. Reams, dude. Who, yeah, who's bush? The one in the black and white. Yeah, don't. And then look at the. Yeah, that's too much. Go above her to the blonde. Look at that. That's a perfect bush. That's Do we agree? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's. I'll give I you agree. That. I it's agree. A, well, yeah, but so there's limitations to what you look at. That yeah, beautiful porn. That's, that's fair play. That's great. Type in landing strip because I don't that's think what? I, I don't. Even that's remember. fair play. That bush. You I think, think that's okay good, right? That. That's yeah. a good bush. Fair I agree. Play, it's yeah. good bush. All right, good. We'll, good we'll bush. allow it. We'll allow it. Mine's like that, but no labia hair. You can't really have that. I mean, the I'm okay with her having it. it. Yeah. But the, yeah, it was the 70s. The yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. The landing Ew, strip. the landing strip is rough. It does a, uh, How come they never have actual pictures I feel like that was more like a gimmick in the 90s. What do you do? What do you do? Who's that preacher on the far left? <laughs> wow, yeah. Look that, at is, that. that does look like preacher. <laughs> he stole my Applebee's gift card. <laughs> that does look like a preacher. Why would we Google landing strip? And uh, yeah, so these are all the different types of. Look, Google shingles and you'll see the woman I want to age into. I so think I've already showed uh, you this. The martini glass, the Brazilian I think triangle, I've you this before. the landing strip. I don't think attack. no one yeah, do, no cute. one does any of that. That was like a, that was like oh shit. Go to the website. Oh, God. No, just this go away from images. You have herpes. That's what that is. <laughs> Google. Here she comes. Ew. There she is. Look at her. Don't look at the shingles, but just look at her. How? Wait. Because my is... boss got shingles, and so I googled it, and this what lady came up, and I was like, holy shit, that's who I want to age into. <laughs> look at her. <laughs> She's beautiful. But you to be like just Google shingles. No, trust me, trust me. That's the woman. <laughs> The gray-haired woman. Look yeah. at her. There is something powerful about a woman going gray, but you know what? You know, you got to be divorced. She's got a, the slacks on. There's a vibe with the, about it. Yeah, and she's got shingles. And she's got shingles. She doesn't give a fuck. I thought shingles were like shin splints. I know. I thought there was something else like that too. And also, why couldn't my boss work because he had shingles? What a bitch. What you is have it? A rash? It's, a, it's a herpes. Herpes. I don't zoyster. know what it is. Go to symptoms. I think it does have something viral. Painful rash that appears as a blisters in the trunk of the body. Pain will persist. Oh, nasty! I don't blisters want... and scabs. Yeah, no, nah, it's not fun. I don't think I could catch it. I don't think so. I feel like I. You no, you're a clean boy. I've got a good. Res I've got a good resistance to those things. Really? Natural immunity. It seems like you're sick all the time. Uh, not not with fucking herpes. <laughs> oh, okay. No, gotcha, no, gotcha. not with fucking chest herpes. <laughs> yeah, that is great. You don't <laughs> have herpes. Never had. No, wow. I have, I've had cold sores my whole life. Wow, but um. And that's what it is. Cold sores are the cousin of herpes, and you can build. Well, up they're not really the cousin; they're herpes. But the, yeah, okay. <laughs> well, that, well, okay. Well, then I've never had herpes, but I have lip face herpes. All right. Okay, so you have herpes. Yeah, cold sores. Gotcha. Yes, and they build up the immunity. So now I never, never got cock herpes. That's not what happened. You just have been very lucky, and no, probably no, 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 no. You think that you have had mouth herpes, which has given you immunity to cock herpes? Yeah. No, you're yes. a mentally disabled that's human not, being. That's not. That's true. I promise. Masquerading like a as a, a man who's regular. That's what you're doing. <laughs> Telling women that he doesn't have regular. I've just been so used to lying about herpes. <laughs> you're just walking around. I promise you, tricking wait, everybody into thinking you're a normal Dave, guy. Circular logic. Google it kind of works. Does does cold sores? What? 
No, because what happens is you only get. Yeah, what are you going to Google right now? Do mouth herpes know. make you less likely to get oral herpes? Does Let's cold, see what that does pulls cold up. Cold sores uh, lessen your chance of getting herpes. Do cold sores lessen your chance? It does. And first of all, I haven't had a cold sore in a long time. You must have herpes. Yeah, whatever. It's the same family. They're cousins. They are cousins that live together. Have you ever had herpes? No. Have you ever had an? Uh, like a STD? Yeah. No. I had molluscum t- contagiosum, but on my arms. <laughs> Jesus, I bet you should say. It's like uh, eczema. I tell you about say. No, it's like these little, <laughs> these little bumps, but they went away. Uh, but when they we... said that could technically be an STD, but it could have just been. Arm bumps? Friend. Just like bumps that show up in your body. Everyone gets oh, bumps. Oh, God. I know a guy who was telling me a story. Uh, he was hooking up some chick, and she hit him up, and she's like, oh, I got a herp. I got herp. Uh, no, I got, I got STD. He's like, what is it? And he's like, I don't know what it's called, but it's new. It's a new STD. Recently? Just dropped. Yeah, new new STD just Monkey? Dropped. No. It was like just a new STD. Yeah, no, it's going it's COVID. The, it's going to be the next. It's going to be the next syphilis. It's going to be the next one. It's the next. It's like just, rot the, your brain and kill you type stuff? Well, you, you know, I don't know. But co- your cocks and your cunts are still mixing together c- to create new I STDs. I don't even remember what sex is like. Really? Yeah. Has it been that long? Yeah, it's been a while. What are we talking? What's what year is it? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> no, that's nuts. <laughs> no, how long? When was the last time I went through that? Three, three months? Two months? Two months? Two Maybe months? a month. It's been a month. It's been a couple of weeks. Yesterday, yeah. I had sex yesterday. <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> was it? <laughs> that's why you were late. But before, it was it was a month and a half. But you're blacked out drunk, so you can't remember. Yes, I okay. wish mm. this whole having sex sober thing is rough. That's nuts. Yeah, I feel like I'm, I'm, I'd be impressed. By someone it's really who's hard. like, I'm dating and I'm sober and we talk. And, ugh. Ugh. It's ugh. me. It's wild. Oof. Yeah, it's bad. We, but like sitting down and have dinner. Do you ever go to dinner sober? Like, and I don't go to dinner with people, but I have sex with people sober. Yeah. Hopefully they're blacked out, but really and unconscious. Yeah. <laughs> so this is what girls do. Girls are predators. I give them the pill. She Cardi B's them. Huh? Cardi B them. Yes. What did Cardi B do? Slip a drink. <laughs> Slip something in the drink, take them home, they pass out, and just rob them clean and leave. Is that what Cardi B did? Yeah. Where are you from? She was Jeffy Dahmer. Home? Are you from Philly? Yeah. 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 Home? Everyone in here has retarded accent. Yeah. What do you say? What was it? The encoder is overloaded? He was was talking about the software encoder was overloaded. He was talking about the computer one day. He's like, "Eh, the encoder's overloaded. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. (laughs) Sure it is, (laughs) big boy. No, no. Can you say it again? So the software encoder was overloaded. Wow. Can you you pull it over your nose? Put the mask over your nose. <laughs> Goes over your nose. It's crazy that you guys, because everything else is pretty normal. Mm-hmm. And, then, and every now and again, there's just a word comes in and goes, "Water." The word is over. It's you. Yeah, Gillis has it really bad. Does he? Yeah, he's yeah. Does he, he have a bad? I, I don't know. He's from totally of all very those far of, from of, Philly. Yeah, I think Stav has been doing an impression of people with this online. Nah, well, Baltimore. he's from Maryland, right? Yeah. Or he's from there, and they kind of have the same like. It's the same thing. Dictation of things, and yeah. then Ian's from Delaware, but has a Southern accent somehow. Yeah, we don't know how that. Yeah, happens. Delaware also, gets tricky. He's also like an Italian guy who looks Jewish and all sorts of. He just weird. found he's out a, he's a real Italian big bag of Jewish. crazy shit, huh? He just found out he's a little bit Jewish. He did Twenty Three and Me, which he's is the gayest thing. Jewish. It's the gayest thing he's ever done, and he sucks dick. You think that's gay? <laughs> Anybody who does Twenty Three and Me, I won't talk to them. No, no, shit. dead to me. Right. Have you done it? No. Oh, yeah, no one does. No, no, no one in Ireland does you it. You might as well do it for your dog. <laughs> it's the same thing. Yeah, it's so dumb. It's so dumb. So dumb. Yeah. What are you trying to find out? I'm this white? It's so stupid. I'm just trying to get more personality traits. Why well, you- I'll tell you this, though. Someone did find out. He's an Italian guy that I knew. And they're a big Italian family. They did it. Turns out his grandfather is gay. Puerto Rican. <laughs> yeah, so same thing. Who yeah. cares? He's same Puerto thing. Rican. Who cares well it's just interesting to find out that your his granddad came over here met an italian girl and she was like oh i don't date puerto ricans he's like i'm italian and then oh. he married he went his whole life without ever telling anyone died and then they figured out that he turns out he's just a fucking puerto rican scumbag getting knee deep in some what pussy dude what a fucking Woo. beast yes He's like, yo, my name is Jimaji. Yeah, that's all it's Jim for. Just, I'm 18% a liar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, a lot of people find out that their mother is their sister or whatever. You know what I mean? 
Things like that? No, they don't. They do. People that happened do. with that one People are oh, documentary. Yeah, That's dude. the only time 23andMe has ever been no. used. Jack Comstock, Red. he has like all these siblings and they all met. Because of... Uh, 23andMe, because they found out, they were like, oh, you have a sibling here, here, here. And the dad was just donating sperm forever. They all met up, took a picture, identical faces, insane. Uh, was that from the show? From the guy? That was a real life... Or... The guy who impregnated everybody? They made a show about some guy... No, like, that's like the out. evil doctor. Mr. Evil? Who? This like artificial insemination doctor. Well, I, you don't need these. You know that. Okay. No, but I'm trying to be professional. Sorry. What if I press you come this? in here with your piglets out? I didn't hear it. You have no idea what that was. Mm -mm. That was great. Have a guess. Bow, bow, bow. Was that it? Yes. <laughs> How did you know? Wow. Because you're an idiot. Titty ball. Of course you would have that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What about this one? Guess this one. There's no what way you get. Did you do it? Yeah. Come on. Bow, bow. Oh, oh no, let me go again. Let me, I'll do it again. You get, guess another one. Get the fuck it's out the same of here. Is it? <laughs> yes. What? Did you notice? Crazy. What is that? Are you serious? I have a fucking Wait, thing. Wait, play it. Oh, I can't do that. Play it again. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? That's crazy. I'm fucking so, I'm. You got like a thing. It's like a mirror behind my back or something. Whoa. How'd you do that? <laughs> That's crazy. Ian on the podcast was like, Ian was like, look me in my eyes and tell me my favorite color. And I was like, turquoise. And he was like, yes. It was crazy. You and got like a little witchy thing. Yeah, you got, got a little witchy, witchy vibe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I feel yeah. like you're very wise and you can give great advice, but your life itself personally oh, is a it's shambles. Oh, so messy. Yeah. <laughs> I hate That's it. just your thing? You I go, give Come so here, let me tell you what to do. And <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then go do the opposite. I know. Ron on the other day, I had him on the podcast, or he had me on his podcast, and he was like, you were the one who got me on Prozac, which is insane because your life is so fucked up. Yeah. And then he compared me to Hannibal. Lecter, who was a therapist, means. and I was like, "This is mean." Y yeah, you are a <laughs> yeah. You kill people <laughs> and you eat them. And it you're is a true. Therapist. <laughs> I do not follow my own advice, but that's just because I don't have any self control. If I can, if other people have self control, then I can help them with their life. But if I don't have any of that, if yeah. I had self control, oh my god, oh my we'd god, be fine. Oh my I'd be unstoppable. And what's pro be what, what does Prozac do? Just keep away the uh, keep away the Prozac is the best drug. What, what happens? What would I? What would I? What would happen if I did it? What would I feel like? What would I change? You know how when things come up and you're like, that doesn't, that's not helpful to me. Just like, let it go. But then you're just like, absolutely not. I will open it up and stare at it. And with Prozac, it's just way easier to be like, all right, that does, get get out of here. Way easier. Things don't bother you as much. Yeah. You just like see things more the way that you know they are. You're like, I know that the lucid way to see things is that like, this is bad for me. This is good for me. And I'll do that. But what if I didn't? That like, what if I didn't kind of goes away. You're able to you're able to just sort things out easier without so like, falling into. So like two years ago, I was at a Dunkin' Donuts yeah. in their Queens. Yeah. And I got um, two coffees. And I said, ask for iced coffees with milk, no sugar, something like that. And then she gave me um, <coughs> milk coffees or something, like two milk coffees or it's something. 100% milk. I, I don't know what the fuck it was. Yeah. And I was like, that's not what I ordered. And she goes, that's what you asked for. And I go, I've never even heard of these drinks. Yeah. Why would I? And she goes, that is what you asked for. And I remember going, why the fuck would I even say that? This is crazy. Yeah. And uh, it's still to this day bothering me, that fucking <laughs> bitch. Yeah. It's every now and again, I go ask that Dunkin' Donuts. I go, that fucking cunt. Because that fuck. bitch still work yeah, here. I wouldn't even mind though, because I said, <laughs> obviously I didn't ask for that. Yeah. But then she goes, yes, you did. And I go, no, I didn't. And yeah, she goes, no, you did. She goes, no, you it. did. And I go, you're the one who's fucking at Dunkin' Donuts. Yeah. I'm on this side of the counter. I'm about to drive this truck. I'm an intelligent immigrant. You suck. Yep. I've yeah. had, I have a so lot of those. So will Prozac get rid of that? No, I still have those very much. Just your little fucking fuck them. Yeah, there was a guy recently who shook my hand too hard as, after a comedy show, and I think about him every day. <laughs> like oh, a fan? Man, what a fucking idiot. Like a fan? He just was like talking to me and trying to kind of like monopolize my time so I couldn't leave. And I, you know, just because mm. he was like a horny, gross guy. And then I was like, all right, I have to go. Nice to meet you. And <laughs> he squeezed my hand Diddy so boy! hard and like crushed Ugh. my bones just to kind of be the like finger roll? one more. Ooh. Yeah, he did the finger Ugh. roll. What's the finger roll? And oh, I, he grabbed yeah, and he just fucks you up. Yeah, and I was like, oh, and I left. And I was so mad still to this day that I didn't say anything about it you yeah pissed but me off forever it really i'm very still very mad about it or a woman in vegas who said it say excuse me when i reached over to grab a straw mm. and she was taking up the whole spit but mm. i got into a huge fight with her so that i feel good about that because you, you said yo don't be hogging the plate you fat cunt <laughs> i said I, I said first of all i said i'm not your kid you don't tell me what to do yeah, you can't my tell manners. me yeah, yeah. insane it should have been no excuse me question mark 
Huh? That's better because she's not telling you. She's like, no, no, excuse me. She should have said, excuse me, because right. that's a rude way to be like, you're in my way. Not say, excuse me. Don't fucking tell me what to do, you stupid bitch. I think you should have oh, my God. We, we had it out screaming at each other, screaming. Ranan standing there just like <laughs> spitting peanuts on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're not clean, clean up. <laughs> clean up on us, too. You brought trail mix in here the other day. I was sweeping for a week. <laughs> He can't. I swear Rana, to God. I swear to God. There's raisins under the couch. He's so crazy. I'm going to send out an email. I'm going to send out an email. No messy pig. No outside food. All right. He Rana has a serious <laughs> problem with the eating, the way he eats. Yes, Louie indeed. and him eat the same way. Ugh, oh, this it's fucking horrible. This is just landing on their belly. It's just all over. And that, Poor that, Rana, dude, we that sweatshirt. <laughs> Huh? We can't be we can't be bullying Run on when he's not Sorry, here. That's right. not fair. But he is a slob. He's disgusting. Sweatshirt. Check out his podcast. I had to clean up the studio, so I will say that. Um, Look, that's fair enough. The Einstein <laughs> thing about the messy desk is a genius or whatever is true about Ron. He is very intelligent because of it. But he is a slob. That's yeah. a good excuse. I'm gonna say that. Yeah. 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 He's a slobby guy. My room is insane, but it's all like, you know, Clean? motorcycle parts and like, oh. no. You have to just, make your it, bed? Huh? Got to make your bed. Got to make your bed? Got to make your bed? My bed, it's not obvious to me. It isn't obvious to me. <laughs> um, <laughs> the My bed is made, but then there's just parts everywhere. Just auto parts. There's little lights, bits and, all over the place. Actually, it's kind of cozy. It's witchy. It is witchy? I have a witchy room. Yeah, you got yeah. a, a lot of wicker. Any wicker? Baskets like holding baskets? things. Wicker? Yeah. I, I wish I could know. show you. I have like a knickknack. Like a cornucopia? Just sitting on the windowsill? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. What are you, you, you guys are naming things I have no idea I don't know what a cornucopia is, but I went with it because that's what you do in comedy. Yeah, of course, for sure. Well, what's mm. a wicker then? Like a wicker <laughs> basket? It's a cornucopia. Yeah. Like a basket? Yeah. Do you have any, ja do you have any jams knows. and shit? Yeah. Salem, Massachusetts knows. Yo, you all into witches, dude? Uh, yeah. Also Midsummer, a bit midsummery. Midsummer. Yeah, it's a big wicker uh, thing and there's like vegetables in it. It's the Fruit of the Loom fucking logo. Oh, yeah. Like my underwear is in one of those things. Exactly. You know I mean? Yeah, totally. It's a fruit basket. Is that what that is? Basically, uh, yeah. I mean, we don't get it. No, we hate it. real, real riveting Ooh, stuff. I know. No, no, it's, no, it's good. There'll, there'll, be, there'll be something good at the Look end of Look at that. Look at that wicker corncopia, dude. <laughs> Nice. All right, cool. So this is what's on the side of your bed, but it's full of like. Uh, this is actually good. It's full of nuts and sh like. Yeah. It's filled with fruit of the it's, loom. No, it's full of like random screws and it's shit. It's very. If a kid was yeah. let loose in my room, they would have a lot of fun. It's very like really? little secret. There's like little Legos? jars that you can open and little tins that have like little gold in them. Yep. There's, there's a, a great time. There's a there. full <laughs> ounce of gold hidden in my room. Or yeah. Like ounce. a like a little like skinny bar. Yeah, like a two thousand dollar bar. Yeah. Is that the price of gold these How days? How big do you think it is? How well, big do you think an ounce of gold is? How big do you think two thousand dollars worth of? How big? Do Sixteen you think? ounces. He's right. He's right. Well, I'm thinking. Of, but did you ask him the size? Of the size of the I cup. seen a bar of silver, you? but that was, I guess, yeah, a different weight. Yeah, silver's different. Dingus. Yeah, wow. Dingus. It's look this at big. him. Look at him. Well, He's wearing an eagle's hat. You think he knows yeah, that about think elements? I own any gold? You have an eagle's hat. Ugh. Ask him the periodic table or whatever. Sorry. I dated a guy who was a really big fan of eagles, and it was awful. Was he from Philly? It was like his whole personality. No, which no. was a really it's fucked from the up Midwest. Part. Oh my god, that's just embarrassing. <laughs> no, it was awful. It was awful. Well, maybe maybe his parents fucking moved to the Midwest. No, they they didn't. How'd you get into? I mean, oh, whatever, whatever, whatever. How do I get into it? No. How did he get I, into? I was about yeah. I, he just I, chose. Yeah, now that's retarded. I know. I know. Like I'm allowed to be retarded about the Eagles because like. Right there. Look at him. Look at him. I've dated two people like that. My first boyfriend, he's he liked the Patriots because one of them helped his mom change a tire on her car. Was it his father? Like, did the player fuck his mother? No. I could. If I met a guy from the Eagles, you would or something, I could. I think I could probably get it behind that. You have to do it from where you're from. That's the rules. You can't switch around like that. Well, who That's am insane. I supposed to support? Fucking the London Beavers or something? You're not from here. You can choose. That's I the chose, luxury I chose, you get. I chose Green Bay Packers. Green Bay Packers. Because you're a little fudge packer? Yeah. yeah, yeah. I, thought, I, thought, I thought it was a gay club. Uh, and then and it is actually with Rogers eventually. He'll come out eventually. Rogers is a fanook. You know that? Is it what? Gay. I think, is that's, I think that's French for gay or something, is it? It's Italian, what for, gay. Italian for gay. He's a yeah. fanook. Fanook. He's a oh. fanook. You don't know fanook? No. He's a mezzo fanook. You got and a, I'm very Italian. You got, are you? Yeah, half. <laughs> Oh, very the one half. Yeah, but he they say he's in the closet. Let's and, see him. And he never came out. Alice asks, I have a gaydar like a heat seeking missile. You don't know Aaron Rodgers? Oh. Well, I just can't he's understand your accent. 
Yeah. He's not gay. That's not. Everyone he, said. Nah, he's the ultimate bro, dude. Brett, wow. Brett Favre said, called him gay for years. <laughs> and then also he used to date the Asian girl. She's the hot Asian girl. She's famous. Olivia Munn? Yes. Who's mm. with now? Watch John that Mulane. Patriots John punt from the other day again. That was so good. Uh, the yeah. run back. Um, and yeah, she said that she goes, I used to date a guy who was a sports athlete and he would only ever fuck me in with the lights off. Doggy star. And, he, and she and uh, oh, is that him? That's that's him. That's him like four. Oh yeah, years he's ago. gay. You think he's gay now? Well, he's just growing out the beard to prove he's not gay. But now that I see him without the beard, he's gay. Yeah, maybe, totally. maybe, whatever. I I would I I don't care if he's gay. I'd, I'd like him to be openly gay. I would like go. The yo. hottest guy is who's who does the podcast with Sam Morell. What's his name? Mark Norman. No, 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 no. Football player. Oh, uh, Julian. Yeah, he's so hot. Who? Edelman. I don't, I don't even know. He has a podcast with Summer has a football podcast out there. Who's it's that right. guy naked? It's is that right. Edelman? That's that's yeah, that's your boy. Is there any footballers in the NFL that have ever came out? Is there anyone that ever just like yo There I, was one guy. I love Cox. Let's get with it. Get 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 on with it. See you later. Are there any? There, there can't one. be. There I can't just, be. It's like the army. You know, too many Jamaican men play in the NFL and they're not gonna accept a a ball thrown at them by a gay man. You don't think? I don't think they so. They just won't they, they catch hate, it. They hate it. They They'll go, just dodge it. They, they go, yeah, they go, fuck. Oh, I ain't no gay, man. Don't throw the gay at me, man. Don't throw yeah. the gay at me, man. Go home and eat the pussy, man, you gay man. You know who's best speaking of Jamaican? Chet Hanks. I'm obsessed. Oh, Jake yeah. Velasquez yeah. showed him to me. He's unbelievable. Have you seen Jet? him? Yeah. yeah. Oh, my Is he God. Him? He's been around. He's gone. I love He's this watched. man He's so done. much. Bring up the man, not. But he 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 can his thing is he was claiming he was like a it was like a homage. Is that the word? Homage. He was paying homage. He doesn't know what the fuck he's doing. He's just he's doing the, it for fun. It's the best. He is so funny. He's the best. But I also appreciate He's so pure. Him. Me too. Yes. Not like the other brother. He's like a Down syndrome person. He's just pure. The pure other joy. Bumble clot. So the other brother on the very left there, you see? Him? Colin. Colin from all the, he always plays like a, a bookworm. Like and all a serial his, killer. Not even a serial killer. You wish he had that. He's in Dexter being a weirdo. Is he? Is he? He's usually like a secretary or, or the. or the In Dexter, I'm, but then he's still like subplot serial killer. Is he? He's in Dexter as a fucking lunatic, right? No, I can't no, know that. No, Dexter's the lunatic. No, but he's one of the like bad guys. But that most. Dexter like. I am DB, please, just as a sidebar. <laughs> no. Forget about it. Just let it go. He's not in Dexter. <laughs> There's something where he's a weirdo. He just looks like a weirdo. No, the brother. Tom Hanks is a pedophile. Brother, he's in Fargo? He's in Fargo. He always plays he's like- He's in Orange County. Great movie. He always plays really like the, the husband that has the dinner ready for you when you get home. And you're like, sorry, I was late. I'm yeah, he's like the I'm sad bad Midwestern guy. Yeah, and the wife is like a badass wife. Mm. And he's like, oh, can we spend time together? And she's like, sorry, I'm off doing cool shit. Yeah. I'm off solving crimes and shit. Clean the bed. Meanwhile, Chet Hanks over here. Chet's out there rapping. And and and, and have a, he's doing rap videos with ugly women. The white That's boy summer, Jet, dude. Yeah. Oh, oh, white, a word. Him on Z was is great. What was that song? <laughs> Bing bummer. A white boy summer. Yeah. That was what was the remember that? The white, the white boy summer. summer. Yeah, but what was the words? You don't remember? No. He was good on that. What's that girl's name? Z Way right there. Z Way? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that was he fun. Shit on Amazing. Her. I loved that. Well that the two of them are mates apparently in real life. They've known each other for years. Really? So, yeah. I don't believe that. And Z Way that Seaway, I don't know who the fuck where Some, she came yeah, from. Yeah, she popped out of nowhere. She just she popped up being annoying. And I remember really, every comedian and their mother applied to be on her job. Remember that? Everybody was doing a packet for her. No, I've never show. done a packet in my life. Never came I've never done a packet either. People don't even t tell me about packets. I don't want to know about them. I'm not in that world. If they say am I... La, 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 la. For anyone listening, a packet is a... You put Dumb. together, I guess, a portfolio kind of thing for... Oh, it's so gay. And then they just steal all your right. ideas and yeah. don't hire you. You get to like give us one sketch and five topical jokes and um, you know it's to come. I, I think, think I'm gonna say no to Corden. How do you feel about that? Oh, well, did you just do Corden? No. Oh no, right, you did no, the better no. one. I did the Tonight Show, the real one with the cool I one. I actually did Jimmy Fallon, a guy who doesn't spit at staff when they fucking cook a steak meal. I want to. I want to turn down Corden and then make a post that says, "I'm not doing this in solidarity with the, with the, <laughs> wow, what, with the what is it called?" The workers, yeah, the restaurant workers. The restaurant workers. I'm doing this because his wife ordered an egg yolk omelet, which is wow. the most disgusting <laughs> thing a human being could ever order. 
Yes. And I will not condone egg yolk omelet. Also, you'd get a fucking free meal at a... What's the name of that French restaurant that, 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 that grilled them? You think they would? Definitely. That's that more... guy Because that guy's a notorious lunatic too. The guy who runs that uh, restaurant. It's in Soho. I can't remember. It's a famous French restaurant. Um, anyway. Have you been there? No. I've been there to buy croissants. What did you just call them? Croissants. You guys are okay with that? What do you call them? Croissants. No, croissants. Croissants. You put the, the wrong and fastest on the wrong label. I've, I'm going to tell you this. First of all, croissants. I don't know what that, the other fastest was. It's not. Croissants. 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 I'm close at the France. Croissant. I, I was born close at the France than you were. Croissant. 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 Yeah, croissants. Anyway, Balthazar is the place, did Overrated croissants. Says the guy who spells his name wrong so other people can say it. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with that? It's crazy. <laughs> is that what? Why is that crazy? Because it's not your name. Your name isn't Co- Gollum like that. It's it, Cullum. It's it's spelled Cullum. Cullum. No, it's not. Yeah, but Cullum. if you just had it C O L M, people would it, you'd immediately be affiliated with your Irish instead of Cullum, where we affiliate with Gollum. No. No, or a well, column, like a pillar. Your name is also, column. But it is also spe- That's not a fictional way of spelling it. I didn't create that. There is. It's a very, in Ireland. Yeah. Oh, okay. Lots okay. of columns. Hey, spelled did that you way. see Banshee? Whatever it's called. No. It's so good. What's it about? Unbelievable. It's about some witch. No, no. What's it called? The call. The something of the Banshee. It's an Irish movie. No. Is it? Oh my gosh. Oh, it's so with, good. With the new one with Colin Farrell. It's so. Yeah, good. I've heard. Yeah. I really. That's I good. can't. Those I, guys are funny. Those guys Unbelievable. Are fucking funny. So funny. I like Colin Farrell a lot. He's the best. Colin's a good guy. He's a bad motherfucker. Yeah, I can't believe how good he was in this. Yeah, he's a good actor. And also, he lived a life. Remember, he was cracking up and fucking Britney Spears? He kind of caught. Oh my God, I had no idea. Colin Farrell is really out of control. When, when, she, oh, when dude, she should be back under the conservatorship. What's going on? It's really crazy. And people are like, this is liberation. It's like, no, she needs a fucking hospital. The other yeah. night, she was like, she, she wrote, should have been locked like up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they should put her in a fucking Looney Tune bin. Where's all the people about free Britney now? Where are they? Yeah, they're like, oh, this is. Is great. They were yapping. She's naked online. She's writing, I love to suck dick or whatever. Did you see it's that? It's insane. It's really crazy. Colin, people are like, this is freedom. Colin, so many people are like, you go, girl. It's very, it's ghastly. Now she's got that one husband who's just like, uh, the counting most her money, appropri- probably even I mean, worse. the most, what is it called? When you take something from somebody you shouldn't. Stealing? No, come on. <laughs> if I was, if I was siphoning off of a you rich sycophant? person. No, not a sycophant, but oh, nice use of the close. word. Exploitative. Ah. Skimming. Skimming. Yeah, it's the like top. what her dad was doing, but now this guy like acts like the hero. I think is my it? brain is failing from long term COVID. Is it? Yeah, I think so. Is it possible you you've done you too many podcasts? Yes. Your brain is wrecked. Do you yeah. think that's real? I definitely right now. Absolutely. <laughs> this is what's our fourth. I've done third, so definitely. many today. Yeah. Three. Yeah. So what happens is then you go, oh. Four. This is the fourth. I'm going to kill myself. This is our fourth, is it? Third. That's a lot. Really? Yeah, whatever. I was just looking. Yeah, are you going to new jokes? Come on. What's new? Jo- oh, at the, the come I'm, on. I'm not, I'll head over. Yeah, nice. And um, work on some new jokes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm been bombing lately, a lot hard. I'm on really. A, I'm on a real bombing. Those are good for you. They reset I guess, I guess. the wave. Yeah. They well, you know what it is when you you, you uh, I think you go through these cycles where you go, this is the new stuff, and you're passionate about it, and you finally get to work, and it works better than everything else. And then what happens is then you yes, go, know, actually, that joke's awesome. actually kind of shit. And then you don't even want to say it. And then you show up. And, and go, then you say it really quickly. Yeah, and, and you, you dissociate. You, you and cut, they're like, you, what are you cut, doing? Yeah, you cut like a set of or a tag. It's crucial, and you're just bombing, and everyone goes. <laughs> the you look. saved your ass the other night, though. You dug yourself a big old hole and then got out of it. Where was this? At the VU, you were doing crowd work about you got on. I was talking about incest porn, and then you got on stage and yelled at everybody that that was like the lowest tier of porn. That was like the most vanilla form of porn. Nobody agreed with you. <laughs> and I, then I, no, 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 no. <laughs> Me and you agree with each other. Of course, of course, of course. <laughs> we're perverts. Yeah. But and then you start to, the best thing. I think that I would love. I think you should just cut it up, just because it's I for will. you to have. But you go. You're like, everybody wants to fuck their mom, right? And nobody said anything. And you were like, you were like, let's just pretend this never happened. <laughs> and you're like, That's not how I want. It was so because you were going so hard on everybody. And then you suddenly made the turn of like, oh, fuck. I wish I had never done this. Yeah. It was good. It was but they really need good to know. Safe. They need to know that they're prudes. Although, yeah, but you saved it. Sometimes I do that thing like I did last night where I get too machismo and I'm like, uh, fuck, fuck you, Hasidic Jews. And if I had backed off a little and been like, I hate myself, there was a moment where I did and it helped. But it is like you have to you have to show mm. your belly at some point if you're bombing in that way. You yeah, know what I mean? But I had a, I had a joke about coming on a girl's face is kind of like 
it's like dirty. And then some someone like literally do it like they all started laughing. There was like a table laughing at me going, yo, that ain't dirty, yo. And I go, it's not. He goes, nah, that's, that's like that's like nothing. Coming like, on a girl's face is not. I think it's a lot. That's a lot for me. I don't know. Maybe I'm a fucking priest. It's yeah. But um, I'm with you, I think. I don't even know how to bring it up. The only way it's possible is if she's it's like fucking so come awful on my face. When they say that, it's so awful when a guy I, goes come on like your reflect. face. You're like, no. It, yeah. My eyelashes. That's why it's so and insane just, to think about it, it being like, 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 and it's not like it's it's pr- it's it's really not pretty. Why do you like doing it? I don't like doing it at all. I'm just I have a joke about but doing why it. Why is talk, the oh talking about be, how how dirty it is? That's all. And then someone was like, "No, that ain't dirty. That's ground." Le-. I go, "What? I've only ever done it like one of my of times. friends had a guy go <laughs> and spit into her vagina, and I'm fine spit on the vagina. Oh, I was going to say face. <laughs> Yeah, no, that's, that's not. You can't make Isn't that noise. Isn't that insane? I you think can't about it spit. Get the phlegm in there. That's not a spit. That's like a violation. That's she's not, that's, had so like many good ones. She had a guy there. say "Let's go" while they were coming. She had a guy who said "Let's go." Yeah, nah, he rules, dude. And she had a guy say, <laughs> "I want to no. fuck you every Christmas." <laughs> Is that me? Let's go. Yo, can I come on your nose? <laughs> Hold on, wait. Yeah. Hey, turn, <laughs> hey, turn it over. <laughs> turn it over. <laughs> open your turn mouth. Turn over. <laughs> open, open your mouth. mouth. Open your mouth. Hey, Hold on. I got it on your news. <laughs> open your mouth. Yeah, this is funny. Disgusting. It is just talking without opening your mouth, right? You just have small mouth. Yeah, like a <laughs> when small mouth like, syndrome. Yeah, you yeah. say keep it real small and tight. <laughs> like so, want a hoagie with a Coca Cola? <laughs> wow. And then you pour hoagie. short. Can what? you can you not can you say say it how we say it? Newport short. Newport short. New, Good job. Newport short. But it sounds like say I'm doing croissant. an advertisement. What? Croissant. <laughs> a <laughs> bottle of water. <laughs> Saying water is insane. Water. To me. Water. water. No, say it. Say W A D E R. Water. Yeah, that's normal. Water. Nobody says water. Water. Unless you're him. Water. I say water. There water. you go. That's normal. Water. Nah. Yeah, I think I say D too. The water. boys back home. Yeah. Like I say that. water. Do yeah. I say D. I don't say. You D. say what? Water. Oh, D. Water. water, yeah, yeah, water. Really know. Something in the water. <laughs> 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 All right, folks, we'll be right back after these commercial breaks. <laughs> 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 yeah, hope you bought whatever that shit was. All right. <laughs> That's a, a solid little little vibe it's you got going a, it's on. It's because dude. you didn't say water. I hardly know her. You went water. I don't know. <laughs> you, just, <laughs> you just bailed on the second half. Water. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, this movie rules. I'll go see it again. Let's go right now. Oh, you actually went to a cinema to watch it? Yeah, well, I, I was on the done, road. I haven't done that in years. We were just killing time. Yeah. Oh, I go to so many movies. Yeah, just when you're on the road. Don't you? Yeah. But don't you bring your boy with you? Yeah, we go. We went. You go with your the guy to watch the movies again? That's yeah. crazy. That's Why? Crazy. I don't know. I feel like, does he have a choice? Do you have to make him do that? Is no. Is that like one of those things? He's the guy who wants to hang all the time. Oh, yeah? I'm the one who's like, I need some alone time. Nah, see you see at the show. That's it. Oh, wow. Well, he's one see of my it. close, close friends. Oh, yeah. We have so much fun. Hmm. Is he's he in love with you? No. Hmm. 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 What? Know. Possible. No. Guy court. Guy court. Guy. Like, guy court. Listen, Let's go. Listen. Let's what? get him in here. We can, Guys we, are Dog. No that, way. He's in he's, love with you. Okay. He's no, not even he's doggy. always like, he's... you should date. It would help you. Maybe try a smaller guy, no, a younger guy. <laughs> he's my Water. age. Which is crazy. <laughs> is he? Yeah. He has such a small little young child vibe. He's just short. He's just a short king. Short kings. No, no, I'm short king. How old are you? I mean, how tall are you? 24. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> no, I said how tall are you? 24. Girl, I said 24. <laughs> 24? Are you single? I mean, how tall are you? <laughs> <laughs> I can be. Uh... <laughs> City boy? City boy. Nice. Yeah. Are you a short king? You don't look like a short king. I'm kind of short. What, 5'8"? Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> You're 5'7"? You were... 5'7 and a half. You nah, I'm 5'8". Okay. 5'11 on Bumble. Are you really? Wow, no, you lied no, that much? No, I'm kidding. 5'11 is I haven't been on Bumble in years. <laughs> but would you lie? But of course. It's, you would? it's funny to lie. It's <laughs> <laughs> That is true. That's the best justification. I like post the picture with just like all my boys and I'm shorter than all of them. <laughs> like my friends are really tall. Yeah. Just play basketball with my boys. <laughs> I'm point guard. That's great. I don't know if I, you know, <laughs> as a super tall boy. You're a pretty fucking tall. I'm, I'm a tall boy. I've never had the I know, I always forget how tall you are. Yeah, of a, of a small guy personality. Yeah. How tall are you? 5'9". Yeah. Tall. You big girl personality, though. 
yeah. big girl personality. You come across a six two, you're yeah. about to fucking palm a fucking basketball. And I'm looking face, at that dude. foot. I'm like, is that I'm as big I have as huge one? feet and huge hands? Look at these. I can palm mm. a basketball. You really were born to be a lesbian, <laughs> and you're and you're fighting it. You should see my sister. Is she more lesser? We're both. We just. She has hands even bigger than mine. Wow, you're just also you got bigger right. hands than me. I've. Oh my god, yes, I have bigger hands than every man. Wow. Uh, all right, close enough. Not not too emasculating. Just yeah. Very rare when their hands. Do, are we, do lesbians like a big finger? Is that a is that like a thing? That's what my where, mom where, says. Where That's you, her joke. Yeah. My mom's hands are t- like to hear. They're wow. huge. <laughs> well, she's hung. They're crazy. Yes. yes. But like, we're would, just Nordic. Would they be? I met a Nordic <laughs> woman at a show, and Vikings. she like dressed better than me. You know, she's like more feminine, and like bleached her hair and stuff. And I was mm-hmm. like, oh yeah, this is what I could do. You know what I mean? Like, like a I, hot woman. Yeah, 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 yeah. But because I do this, like, <laughs> you know, wear old hand me downs from teenage boys, mm. I seem just like a dyke. But I could be a hot Nordic lady. Yeah. Well, no. Yeah. Okay. I get what. You, but that's right. Not, no. Isn't Absolutely. your girlfriend tall? Ish monster, yeah, huge, yeah. bigger, bigger. But bitch. nobody's like you're a dyke because you're big. No, because she's like, hey, you right. That's what I mean. Yeah. It's just the whole demeanor is gay, not just that I have huge hands. <laughs> no, I know, but I'm just <laughs> like a quarterback. You're you just look like, really comfortable all the time. Yeah, I am so comfortable. Yeah, oh, you look cozy. I'm He's like, look at those DJ. socks. I'm looking at those socks. Like, I want yeah. those socks. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I'm a witch. You look like you haven't washed your clothes in a while. That's like, that's your they, vibe. They are washed. They're just hand washed. <laughs> in the You're definitely wicker. Nordic, yeah. But I'm just saying, in theory, would that genuinely be a, a better fingering by a long finger? A hundred percent. Long it? though? Yes. Am Not I, long. Long doesn't matter. Better matter. Who has a vagina? Raise your hand. Long, I, 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 long fingies? Long penis, long fingers, long anything in there is better. It can go like that mm. better. Mm. Just play the top though. No, I don't know. I wish I'd, I. mean, well, yeah. I've, I've got tiny some, hands. Some DJ like, scratching though. That's usually. So does anyone ever go like, oh, like does a girl ever go, oh, I love how long your fingers are. Like, oh, you're such big fingers. No, but we're thinking it. We're looking at men's hands all the time to assess. You are. Yes. So every time I hold, I the could p- literally draw your dick by looking at your hands. <laughs> Doubt it. That's fair. all of you. Mm. I don't know. Let's have a get, let's play a game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Get the pencil and some crayons. Yeah. Google different types of cocks and we'll assign them. <laughs> we'll take a picture of all three of our cocks, put them up, and you got to tell which one's which. I could do it. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I've got small. What do you mean? P- human beings are like fractals. They're like what you know. This. <laughs> this is to represent. This is everything. what my vagina looks like. <laughs> is it? It's like we do that with the with the it's, hands it's in it. Incredible grip. I'm... You're like that guy who shook your hand here tonight. Look at <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> the, yeah. The grip king. That's insane. Let me draw your guys' dicks. Let's see how close I am. Yeah, let me see. Yeah, no, this will be fun. Here okay. This Here won't make me that. lose sleep or whatever. Or it'll give me she, she'll never get extreme more. confidence. Get the curl. You got to get the curl. You, 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 right you, right you, you got to get the curl in there, right? Who are you doing right now? Ew. He said <laughs> curl. You got to get the curl in there. Well, he's projecting. You would have a little pig dick, wouldn't you? <laughs> no, it's not you a have, spiral. Do you have like a Dr. Seuss <laughs> dick? Like, no, I can't crack a, I can't open the a, trees from the lore. I can't open a bottle of wine <laughs> with the fucking you? thing. You just have a little elephant. <laughs> a little elephant. What the you have to unroll it. No, no, that's like Bill Clinton. Bill Clinton's cock curls around the corner, doesn't it? Why do you know that? Everyone knows everything about people's dicks. We, <laughs> It's like a common thing. Hey, did either, did any of you guys see Planet Terror? No. Yeah. Sorry about that. Draw my dick. What about <laughs> it though? You want to tell us? Use your hands. I got bad fingernails. Okay. <laughs> I'm insecure. Don't look. My cock doesn't have fingernails. <laughs> but the, the, the fingernails on my cock are very clean. It's just hard. I mean, that's. <laughs> Am I already off? I mean, no, you're eighty percent of the way there. Eighty <laughs> percent. That is my cock. It is generous head. Generous? Yeah, you do have those short little stubby fingernails. Yo, it's a good little game. That's that's spot on. You could like, is it? That's spot on. I'm straight as an arrow. Show us, show <laughs> us. That's your, that's his cock. I feel like that's everyone's cock. Little tiny balls. <laughs> <laughs> well, now that was a home run. You should. Uh, you could like sit in Union Square or something, and just like paint people. Like you knock out of the park. But like they all sit. I'm down, always and right. They, and then you just do someone's cock and be like. Sometimes you pray you're not right, but I'm typically right. Yeah, the tiny balls just threw me for a whirlwind. How did you know? And it's thin. How does she know? A little thin. Yeah, Yeah, but that's that's definitely my (laughs) cock, the one that curls back and points out my belly. (laughs) There you go. There you go, folks. There's the the artwork done. That's 
We will be auctioning that off. <laughs> that is a, for the for the money. Um, the money all money will go. Evolution to just trying it. to get you to not procreate. Just send <laughs> the cum right back at him. Don't let it go anywhere. It's, well, what actually genuinely, if you want to know scientifically, if that was the case, it's because what happens is here you have a callus or something. What happens is you have like an a, HPV speed you, bump. <laughs> just what, just what, I, I've never had herpes, but you. What happens is the blood won't flow through there. So then when you get hard, your dick only flows to what one you, side. What, do people really have this? People have curled cocks. Google Bill Clinton's curved cock. Yeah, some I people do, got Mervin Curvins. My guy, my, yeah, my guy will a little bit back slap here. Slap your belly button. What? So, some guys get... get like, really? I've seen a guy that took a hard left turn, like a That's 90 a, degree turn. 90's nuts. That's but, insane. But, but not a little oh. like path, though, like no. a little... One no. way or the no, other. No, this one was busted on around a corner or something. Yes. <laughs> it was bad. So, so what happens is they, they have this. <laughs> it was scary. Got American history ads. <laughs> it was nuts. It was I had to sling. approach from a different angle. I had to like slide on like it was, you know what I mean? Tetris? <laughs> I, had to, I was next to him fucking him. No, nah, that's, yeah, but I think you can get a good curl back. <laughs> and that's not my penis. Bent dick disease nice. is a real thing. I, yeah, I, it's called Peroni's I don't, I don't, syndrome. Oh yeah, Peroni's. Yeah, 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 yeah. I remember yeah. being like, it's a great beer. Peroni's a great beer. Yeah, you have Peroni's, and what happens? <laughs> I is, got Peroni's at home. Why you want to hang? Laddie, da. Does uh, he have a bent dick? That's yeah. So you have Peroni's, and what happens is, whatever way the blood goes in and out, you've got like a. Almost no like way. a blocked artery. And what happens is the blood will only go to one side, so it curls it. My guy curls to the left a little bit, but not much. But definitely enough to... Yeah, mine's, enough for me to know it. I don't think anybody's straight. Oh, well, there's some no. straight ones. Oh, yeah? Like a fucking ruler? Like, like a fucking, just perfectly, just like symmetrical with no, the ground There's no, there's no straight lines in nature, baby. No. No, no straight lines in nature. Fuck that. Get out of here. Needs a little bit of a bend. Needs a little bit of a, a foreskin. Needs a bit of stink. Mostly straight. Couple of They're freckles. Mostly straight. Couple of freckles on there. Never hurt nobody. Yeah, it's just a freckle, baby. Don't worry about it. <sighs> yeah. yeah some, some weeks it's there. Some weeks it's not. You know I can't I mean? believe it curls <laughs> up. That's just what happens when you try and fuck Hillary Mine Clinton. Your dick is just like no. Oh! <laughs> his, 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 his curl's really bad, apparently. His who, Bill who said this? Monica in her Monica, testimony. Monica came out. That lying cunt. Um, really? She said I have to unroll it. In order to suck it? No, she just to said... To boost get, my career? It's like a scroll. They, they never fucked... He can't fuck or something. Built oh, it. wow. It's too, it's too bad to fuck. Just massages. It's like a kind of a thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got, you just, he, he would jerk off on her leg or something. Oh, that's how he that's how he got caught, dude. Just come on the dress. the dress. She didn't wash her dress. He came you on the dress. You gotta start washing your clothes, dude. I Next thing you know, you're gonna get the president. Next thing yeah. you know, the president's gonna be fucking. <laughs> so wash those socks. Up and I gotta tell you, I wasn't around when Clinton got caught for that, but fucking legend, you know. So, so just come out and be like, oh, I did not have sexual relations. Yeah, it was awesome. That woman. I remember it. And then he got caught and went, sorry. And then he just ne- and then he sorry, got and then he sorry, won re-election. <laughs> that's said, sorry, that. I'll leave, dude. He didn't win re-election after that. Did he not? No, he resigned. He didn't resign. Yes, he did. He was impeached, but then he resigned. He was up for impeachment. What do you mean he resigned? From what? Office. President. Then who took over? The next guy. Oh, well, then, no, you're right. Then his term did end. His term ended, naturally. Yeah, because it went I'm right telling next you. Oh, because it was close enough that they were like, just let him. Just let him. Yeah, the impeachment went That's too right, because it was going to be somebody. He wrote it out. I don't know who his vice something. president was. I don't know. I was maybe three when this happened. Did he quit? Oh, God. No, it never happened. He was, he, was, he was allowed away. And apparently he showed a fucking... Cigar up our fucking twat at one point too. Happy New Year! There you go, <laughs> bang. And now Cuban. Why two K? <laughs> you can't get these legally. Whoa. Ma- Monica's gone. Oh, Mr. President, because his dick wasn't straight, so he fucked her. Yeah, that's crazy. That's what all these guys get away. Like, I don't know. know about that. Like truthfully, though, I I'm, I, was... I want it to be true, so it, it, it is true. <laughs> yeah, sounds like it's something Hillary's covering up. But they I didn't all know that Harvey up. Weinstein's dick was like melting off his body. Yeah, yeah. Was... What the hell? What did a dog eat? What happened? I don't know. That's why I was asking you about Planet Terror because in that movie, Bruce Willis's dick melts off. Whoa! And I was wondering if that was after the Harvey Weinstein thing, and that if Robert Rodriguez or whoever made that movie was doing like a homage to that. But I don't think I think Weinstein was the melted after. penis homage. Yeah, the melted, melted penis, penis homage. homage. We, we, we can't homage look that Harvey Weinstein penis. But everyone had fucked up penises. They say uh, look up Planet Terror and just type in Harvey Weinstein. They say Epstein's cock was like an egg, like a boiled an egg. egg, like a little boiled Stop. egg. Stop! Oh my god, that's what I picture yours to be. Eggy? <laughs> no, no, no. I no, wish no. I had the girth. <laughs> I, <laughs> yeah. I wish. My, <laughs> a my, pickled egg is what I've always been. Uh, uh, mine's more like a, a big, Vienna sausage. Mine's more like a big pan. <laughs> mine's a big pan. Of that. 
No, no, no. I, you've no idea. Mine's more like a line of coke. It doesn't say. All right, unrelated then. A lot of these guys have fucked up cocks, dude. And they get word Planet gets Terror. around. Word gets around. After Robert Rodriguez about Harvey Weinstein. Robert Rodriguez lists inaccuracies in... I know two guys who were born with extra large foreskins. And, I know people who were born with mini ones. Mini they can't foreskins? get over the head. Wasn't I know that, like, two convenient? guys. That's all right with them. But no, 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 no. But there's nothing wrong with that, is it? It never goes... Do you understand? Up or down? No, when no, no, it's no, no, softer. It won't... I'm cut, so... It won't... Gay. Okay. Come out. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Patriots. I'm more of a yeah, real man right here. Sorry. They don't understand. I get it. So you could get stuff in there forever. Isn't that all? If you put a nickel uh, in there, oh, it, it won't. Stays. It won't come down. The, yes. the skin. Oh, oh, I thought it was the opposite. Guys I, I thought he just had like a shallow turtle. Now. No, they, that's fine. They're supposed to get that fixed, though. If yeah, they are, but they didn't. I know two guys. So the same similar scenario, but they were born with extra large foreskins, right? Oh. So even when they got hard, <laughs> there was still foreskin hanging. It's like out. a tremor. Yeah, did you ever go soft inside a condom? That's kind of like what it looks yeah. like. Oh. Yeah, yeah. That's what their dick it's looks rough. like all the time. That's insane. I know two guys. That had it, and they had to get operated on when they were like eighteen in Ireland, because that's when you start meeting sluts, and they go, "Yo, that's not what a dick's supposed to look like." Like, oh, oh yeah. So roll your sock. I know two guys had to get circumcised when they were like eighteen. Some circumcision scars are gnarly. What are they? I figured they were just perfect. No, let's see. Good, good circle. No, some of them are like fucked up. Some of them are like deep scarred. You heard about these moils that you got to suck the blood off it or something? Yeah, these Jews. What? Yeah, what is that? The, the, what? The, it, 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 they suck the blood off? They suck the blood off. There's a fraction of these uh, turbo Jews that will suck a little boy's cock when they mutilate it. It's crazy that I know this, but I like don't know like where Russia is on the map. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's just depressing. <laughs> well, it's more important to know that these Jews are sucking off little boys. And did you ever hear about the, they gave everyone herpes? The fucking Jew priest, the rabbi. Gave, so, gave you your cold sores? I wish. Eventually? I wish I got it it's from a good way. I got it from sharing um, milk with my mother. And that's why I got cold sores. How do you know it's milk? You know, that's just what I just have to hope and pray. Um, babies, <laughs> herpes linked to their circumcision practice. Yeah, look, you see that? They suck off your cock and then you get herpes from a rabbi. I got herpes. But that's a great way. Then it goes like, yo, did you give me herpes? It's like, it's not what it looks, baby. I got it from a rabbi. Uh, so <laughs> you're like spiraling. I got into it when someone. a rabbi sucked my baby cock. <sighs> Jewish type of circumcision, which has been linked to the spread of the potentially deadly virus to newborn boys, according to New York City Health, in the ritual known as metzisa, uh, t, t whatever that is. After removing the foreskin Ooh. of the penis, the person performing the procedure places his mouth briefly, briefly over the wound, sucking over the wound, like over the whole penis. Yeah, the, it's Ooh, the penis. Sucking a small amount of blood out, which is discarded antibacterial ointment is applied. And the... Uh, man. This guy should be executed by a firing squad. It's it's no, it's it's it's, it's a religious all the thing. time. It's happening right now as we as we people talk go. About people it. want their kids to get blood sucked. I'm just saying, it's one of my kids. I know, but this is what this is why this is what gets them powerful. Where in That's the Bible what, does it say it? Can we look that up? Bible. It's the adrenal ah, curve. We we're gonna get we should, flagged for should, googling should, this stuff. We should ring. We should ring Ari and see if Ari will answer the fucking. Ari Shafir will answer questions about this fucking thing. Yikes! I think he. he well, that's insane. Of all the people to know. In the world, Ari will have to know, like, why is this guy sucking cock and if it's real and what's going on? Is he very... Ari's very Jewish. He just did a, a special on that. I know that he did the Jew special, but I don't know if that means he knows about Hasidics. I thought or is it he, know, he knows about all Jews. Well, he, he's one of them, too. He's not, he's not the turbo one. He's, like, the less one. Not, like, hats and shit. But he's definitely... Orthodox. He's definitely Kurd. I don't know. I always get confused with the, who he's, they are. He was. He's not... Wait, let me see if this is on a ring. Will this work? He was acidic. Put it to the mic like this. Ari? Ignore oh, it. No. Yeah. You just got to put on speaker into the You know the what mic. I did? I put the wrong fucking thing. I meant to put that fucking... Ah, uh, uh, you don't got the widget. I don't have the widget, baby. But you could, yeah. We could have. I put, put the wrong fucking thing from the thing on. I wish we knew my other acidic Jews. Ranan oh. might know. Ranan's a good good boy to know about the fucking Jews. What is that? Ranan? And I'll go, yo, what's the deal with these... Adam Friedland? I don't know. I don't, you can ring Adam. Oh, I don't have Ranan's number. I have Ranan and Adam. 
No, I anyway, mean, whatever. Let's just like look. They're all creeps. These Jews, and that's what Kanye should have led with. This is what this is would have been more. Important. That's what I'm saying. She should be a concierge because she has yeah, actual like some should've... underlying things that are questionable. Like, yeah. you, like you think controlling the weather's bad. You see what they're doing at circumcision. Yeah. You should see what they're actually doing. <laughs> I don't know why I'm building such a strong case. I should stop. Well, they are they're problematic. These the 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 turbo Jews. They don't look. They, they, it's not like they don't know. They don't look at us like oh wow. They're great. They look at us going, you fucking pigeon brain fuck. I don't you like the, I, didn't, I didn't like that bitch last night. I'm still really mad about it. The chick at the, the me show? Me saying I can't call Hasidic Jews and her saying boo to me. I'm like, I can, this is free yeah, speech. Yeah. What, are you, you're, what are you doing in here? Watching this fucking chicks up here talk about, you know, getting loads blown on my face. Mm. You're just, that's the same thing. You're making fun of me sitting mm-hmm. there. Yeah. Laughing. You know I'm going to hell. You don't care. I never thought, mm. they, I didn't know they would all go, go out like that. I thought the guys have a little guys night. And then the women that stay at home. No, on their social tricycles media has or changed everything. Have you seen the ticking thing people are doing because of social ten... media? Where they do that shit? Yeah, the young kids. You told me. Did I tell you? I think you told me about yeah, this. I've about seen this. Um, it's Tourette's. They have like a new Tourette's. I yes, just found yes. out about it. But then I found out about it yesterday by this girl who works with all these Gen Z people. And she was, she was like, they tick all the time where they're like, and they have to do these things. What and then the fuck? Racine's babysitter was at the podcast today and she was ticking. And I think it's, I mean, ironically, from TikTok. It, 100%. It is, right? Yeah, like the quick. No, no, I don't think it's actually a mental illness. I think it's, I think it's like. <laughs> that's why like they call bizarre. it TikTok. <laughs> we'll be right back after these commercial break, folks. <laughs> da, 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 da. That's not bad. Maybe that's why they call it. TikTok. I just made that joke. I know, but you got to do it more like fucking lay into it. You you, you were like kind of like uh, embarrassed about it. You actually really got to go. Okay. Yo, you all you kids are fucked up. TikTok, more like tick talk. Yeah, that's, <laughs> I get it. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, Yo, look at these retarded kids. Look at these disabled kids. They're not disabled. I think oh. that I, if you look at it, the whole it, it thing is like you have this mental illness. And if you keep telling a kid that they have intrusive thoughts to go... They're going to start going, yeah. it's like a thing. Who are you, Trevor Noah? Yeah. Well, fuck you. Trevor Noah speaks click, click language. Whatever. But then there are really people <laughs> with Tourette's, like that one comedian. Very funny. Just moved to New York. Yeah. Wow. That was great. I'm a, <laughs> give me any disability. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. <laughs> this is blind. <laughs> We did deaf last week. <laughs> I did a left the left, like Christy Brown with the cerebral palsy. Jesus. I can't believe that it's a real, it's a thing though. What's I, you should look up one of the taking videos. That's what we should do. I was watching Nixium. It's too hot in here. The Nixium. Yeah. yeah. Um, you know I have well. R- Renier, off pod. Um, uh, Keith Ranieri. Another great man. That the, the whole second season, I was like, listen, <laughs> these bitches signed up for this. They get they gave him the ammunition. To hold the hostage, and then he was like, I fuck 15 year olds. And I was like, ah, damn. Even his lawyer came out and went, Look, yeah. Everything I think I could have gotten you away with. And then it was like, Once you were found with child porn and fucking kids, I was like, I can't do much about that. He still did try, though. Uh, Yeah, of course. He's a fucking lawyer. You better try to get me off that shit. What the (laughs) fuck am I paying you for, dude? If if I had a lawyer and he's like, Yo, I can't get you away with the child and stuff, I go, Yeah, that's what what I'm paying you for. The Brosmans. What's her name? The Brosmans from the. uh, the, the the ginger ale. The the girl who financed his whole operation was a Brosman. Was like her, the heir, the heir to the really? Seagram's yeah, fucking Seagram's ginger ale. Heir. So, oh wow! So the ginger ale company from Canada, they actually paid for a lot of Hasidic this shit. Jews Seagrams. Ah, it's, it's not true. It's not true. <laughs> we just go. Yup, you know it. We cut fucking out the bit when, it. Cut out the bit when she said not true, will you? Please, <laughs> I want to keep this. Na- she said narrative. so true. She said <laughs> so <Sub> over so <laughs> true. <laughs> so <laughs> say it was say it was totally true. The Seagram say to anyway, but yeah, well, I guess there's like an element that we I mean, definitely he was a creepy cr- corrupt fuck though. Yeah, you know, I know there's like weird laws to it. The thing is, if he just didn't. He just brought it too far. He could have conquered the world, but he kept bringing it too far. I know. Once That's you what start, happens. once you start, this is the problem with all these cults. Once you start fucking them and making them give you your money and f- forcing them to starve and shit. That poor Amy woman, or yeah, who was working, Amy Salzman, who was just like trying uh, Nancy to Nancy Salzman. Nancy, yeah. Whoa. Hey, and she maybe just, you didn't get raped. Yeah. I that love was Nazi. crazy. Nazis great. When people say they're molested, that's just society trying to hold them down. Go, Isn't that right? And then she's behind scenes being like, I didn't know he was molesting yeah, them. He goes, hey, maybe you had some trauma in your life. You can be like, ooh, trauma. Or you can be like, bang, 
He didn't molest me. Yeah, she's reading a thing. Maybe yeah. a man named Keith fucked you yeah, in your tiny yeah. asshole. Goes, That's okay. I felt bad for What's that bitch. Happening? I felt bad for that bitch though. Yeah. She got co- she got gobbled up. And she, then totally. And then even the psychiatrist, she was like, but like we did do a lot of work. And the guy was the girl was like, no, the whole thing was just a thing for uh, yeah. rape. And she was like, mm. <laughs> That was awful. Her whole crying. life's work. Yeah, that was crazy. Yeah, it's a good show. You gotta watch the Nixie Omar. And then I just started tickled. Oh, what's that? I don't like that. About they it's like they take these jock dudes, they hold them down, and then they have people <laughs> tickle Gucci, them. Gucci Gucci them. <laughs> don't like that at all. <laughs> yeah. What, what the are we doing, hell? guys? So they my take, body, my choice. Don't so, be do not tickle me. Something led to blackmail and I haven't finished it, but it's eventually murder and crazy stuff. From tickling? Yeah. Don't tickle. It's called tickling. <laughs> that would that would ruin my week if someone pinned me down and tickled me. I would fucking yeah. Be they blackmailed outraged. these kids who at work getting t- not kids, but these there these dudes. I hate it. But I don't know how it leads to mob stuff. But my friend was like, "Yeah, there's murder and eventually like, like the mafia." Yeah. So we're gonna fucking sit them down and tickle them. Yeah, like these New Zealand people tried to make a documentary on it, and they started getting all these death threats, and they're like, "Just stop what you're doing." The dark world. Of oh tickling. my god, this is the New Zealand guy getting tickled. That's the guy. Yeah, that's the documentary tickling. making. What is oh he doing? My god, I can't that's stand. from 2016. But it's so not it's like, like they're making it seem all happy and fun. I, yeah. re- I react though like it hurt, like it hurts me. Yeah, yeah no, no, that's a form of torture rea- for me. It wrecks like so much. Oh yeah, I'd rather get movie. beat in the fucking yeah. face. I have yeah. been like held down. The child has kill me. Put me on my. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Yeah, I'll tell you what you want. Remember being a kid me. and like wanting to be like, get the fuck off me, but you're laughing so hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah like worst. an older brother's pinning but you down, fucking yeah. with you. But after a while, you don't even. Your head. <laughs> <laughs> he takes it's his crazy. cock out, you suck it up for a while. <laughs> yeah. It's sure. a memorial. <laughs> yeah, we gotta watch all this stuff. But the, the Nixium stuff, why did we even bring that up? But the Nazi salesman, yeah. But that works with the ticks. They cured some girl. Yeah. They cured a girl. They cured a guy who had um, Tourette's and then he became the spokesman for Tourette's and cured loads of people with that mm. same teachings. Yeah. And one of the girls on the show, though, the eventually Nancy just pulled her to the side and she's like, I can't stop ticking. And then Nancy comes up to her and she's like, you're really being a fucking little cunt to everyone right now. Whoa. She went right to her face and goes, fucking quit, cut it out. Is that what happened? She's like, she did. She brought her to the side and goes, listen, no one gives a fuck. You're an attention-seeking little cunt. Shut knock the fuck up. Off. She said, knock it off, all right? See, that's why I want to see Alan. She, and she goes, knock it off. And then Nancy walked away, and the girl just went, just never, she said, she never ticked again. <laughs> or she, she just literally- See, that's ne- why we Maybe need I hard love back in this oh. country. I, but then she's like talking, she goes, I've never ticked again, but I'm filled with nothing but sorrow. Oh, yeah, that's right. She's like, I'm depressed, and I'm just, I want to kill myself. Welcome to the <laughs> club, bitch. That's better than ticking. It's, 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 yeah. Yeah. it's yeah. just how most of us live oh, already. Yeah. Yeah. She, they actually cured everything. Now you make <laughs> less people want to kill themselves, you <laughs> selfish bitch. <laughs> now right. no, no one's looking at you at the cinema anymore. Yeah. For sure. Yeah, or maybe she liked it. Maybe she liked the thing. She loved it. She but loved the but look, curing Tourette's is like it's a hard thing to do. Yeah. Some of you, some of you are gonna have a little bit of the fucking bluesies. That's right? what I'm saying. I thought Keith was on to something big time. Wow, very good. <laughs> That's so far. I think I'm good. I think I think maybe I'm just repressing them. You're ableist as hell, dude. I can't sit by. No. It just does They're feel calling. good. Like the people who do the blinking thing, sometimes you're like, I get it. Yeah, yeah, we all we all have our ticks. Little 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 Sasquatch friend of the show, he comes home and he goes, Look at He's Blinky McGee, a Blinken. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I, 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 I saw him. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That's how many Blinky people I know that I've had to be like, all right. You had that in your back pocket already. Yeah, yeah. totally. But I, last time I saw him at the stand or something, he was like, How's it going, Colin? And I went, Good. And he went, Are you making fun of my ticks? And I go, Yes. Of course. See, I know because he's, he's Gen young. Z, I'm yeah. telling you. Yeah. Well, I'm like, I think I just missed it because like I'm necessarily just Gen missed. Z, but like. Yeah, but if you were in I that wasn't camp, raised on a you fucking, wouldn't be in this room right now. Dude, like, tablet. Yeah. School, yeah. The school yeah. must be so funny. Just having. That's called problematic. Even like now, my nieces and nephews, they're like two years old and like yeah, just I'm, immediately just tablets in their face all day long, all day yeah, long. I'm like, yeah. these kids are going to be fucking ticking. Yeah. They're that kill, be ticked I, off. There's nothing worse than this. They're going to be ticked off. <laughs> they had me ticked off thinking about how ticked off they're going to be. <laughs> I'm sitting there just fucked. <laughs> All right. You wanna, let, let's wrap it up. Oh, we have a question, don't we? Fuck. When's this coming out? Hey, Friday. We have really no idea. But Tacoma. It Monday. I'm going to be in Tacoma December 8th, 9th, 10th. Very good. And nice. then I'm on the road with Louis CK. Oh, never heard, might have heard of him. Never heard of him. Uh, in oh, December. good. Now that he's not as famous anymore. Be Nope. YouTube.com slash Patreon slash Be Pod. No. 
Well, I whatever. Subscribe right. to the BNN podcast with Jordan. <laughs> you should go. Yeah, everything will be in the description. She does a podcast with uh, Ian Finance, friend of the show, BNN Eden with Jordan, available everywhere you get podcasts. Catch on the road. JordanJensen.com for all her tickets. JordanJensenComedy.com. JordanJensenComedy.com. Also, go over to Louis C.K. And Do you think this is a good idea? To open for Louis? Get on Twitter. And oh. start an account where I just bash women with really funny jokes, but then nobody, all these men start following it, but really it's me, a woman. That's a way to get a lot of followers very quickly. You think that's You know what you should do? Post, yeah. or just like get a lot of, just post tits, like not your tits. Like, do you want to hear the first one I posted? Tits of the week. It was, yesterday I had a down, an Uber driver with 100% Down syndrome. He was, to be honest, he was a way better driver than any Uber female Uber driver I've had. Five stars. Spelled S T A W S. <laughs> One like. It's not bad. From me. Is it at Jordan? Gen- oh, you like your own thing? Was it? <laughs> no, I can't tell you what it is. It's a oh, fake name. It's a fake thing? Yeah. Well, we can just search those keywords and find it. <laughs> They're all just start, type in Uber Down syndrome. <laughs> I know. I'm going I'm I'm to search it. Search it right now Stop. and see if it comes. Stop. <laughs> but we got. All right. So go, go support. Are you typing, are you typing them in right now? <laughs> it's a weapon, dude. These are weapons, dude. <laughs> <laughs> fucking broke my nose. She chipped your tooth, dude. <laughs> oh, my nose. I'm Bill and Lily, dude. Here we go. George Bishop I had an Uber driver with 100% Down syndrome. To be honest, better than all women drivers I've had. Five stars. Hell yeah. <laughs> Yo, Share yeah. that, dude. I'll retweet this motherfucker. I didn't know that Come on. you could just find it. Dude, there was no, That's there was the like, funniest name you gave us like ever. all the keywords available. Wait, go he check did it out. that way too fast. What else did George Bishop do? <laughs> How many likes? What have, what have they been liking? They've been liking some stuff here. Are they? Oh. <laughs> Are you liking this random dog photo? It's, <laughs> that's my best friend. <laughs> <laughs> Indian. All right, good. That's, that's it. fair. It's that's probably fair. just all no. in. Yeah, it's all just reliking the same shit. All right, well, that'll be deleted by the time this episode comes out. <laughs> <laughs> the good stuff. <laughs> I didn't know you could easily search I'm me. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> it's one following, one follower. That's so funny. <laughs> Created yesterday. It says, you got, uh, yeah, that's good though. Okay. The only tweet. Hell yeah. Yeah. No, uh, you just if you change the, if you change the name and delete that, <laughs> you okay. no, no one will find out. Nothing. Then it'll be fresh. Whatever. At least people know. No, we'll just leave good. it like that. Yeah. Um. Oh shit. We, did we ever get a question from the fuck? Because we end up we end well, every. Remember podcast. when we saw the Hasidic Jews and we said Reservoir Dogs? Remember. Yes, all that's safe. something you. I could just tweet with the anonymous account. That rules. That is they were, funny as hell. You know what I mean? Yeah. But is there a way that they could track it back to me besides this podcast right now? Uh, maybe. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah. But can you just say heinous shit on an anonymous name? Yeah, you can. But you just need to never ever share that information. Okay, okay, okay. They'll find it. Okay. But it's good. It's actually the most fun Twitters are like always just someone called like Mr. Beans. And okay. it's a photo. Yeah, like of like, a fake. It's like yeah. a photo of Michael Jordan crying or like whatever. John Totoro from like a movie from the 90s. Yeah. For sure. That's the best ones. And then they always just tweet wacky, shit, silly shit. And then they get doxxed eventually, which is all right. Because by the time they get doxxed, it's like 200,000 people. Wow. Following them. You can just rebrand. There's also people who do that where they'll make meme accounts and it's called like. I think it's like, for example, like the uh, the, gir- the girl with no job or whatever, and then after a million, she just starts posting herself like it's her de- like, I'm, like I'm it's, famous. It's now. originally memes, and then it's just her going making coffee or whatever, and you go, uh, nah, this isn't what we came here for. You right, suck, you right. suck, you suck I the hate shit. That. Yeah. Why don't they stop doing that? And then you unfollow them. Yeah. People will crazy. buy those accounts oh, that gotcha, like, want gotcha, like gotcha. to highlight their success. Yeah, but it doesn't work, us because everyone just unfollows no, you. It's, it's just constantly people. Whatever. Yeah. Uh, is there any question there at all that we haven't said? Oh, both of these? Oh, well, we got a question for Jordan. Wow. This is for you. For Jordan. Is it for, mean? What's your favorite tool you've used in your construction life? Multi-tool. <laughs> the wall. This one's Scott on the Patreon, by the way, folks. Um, and uh, yeah, keep these high quality type of questions coming in. What's your favorite type of tool you've used on the con- in your construction life? And a uh, twofer by Scott. Are there any tools so shitty that you refuse to buy? Anything made by that brand now. Ryobi, I will never use. Vestool is the best tool. And then... Oh, it, what a coincidence. It used to be DeWalt in the, ni- in the 2000s and 90s, but now it's Milwaukee or Makita. I prefer Makita. No, I prefer... What are all my tools? Mil- Makita. No, Milwaukee. American. Buy American. But then... Milwaukee. 
What did I just buy? No, I just bought all Makita. Everyone says Makita is but, the best. But Milwaukee... In, Milwaukee's good Second best I like buying Milwaukee Because I like to buy an American I genuinely do <laughs> Even God though it's right, not even brother. made God damn right brother You know it's not even made in Milwaukee It's made in like fucking Middle East or something M- Milwaukee brand They shipped fucking a long time ago Yeah they all those it. jobs They still are the best DeWalt yeah, keep, went keep way keep downhill started, DeWalt sucks now But it used to be the best And then what's my favorite tool Is the multi-tool Great good I hope that answered your question there Scott That's good Alright let me see And Rand McNally Wow Please rank the following joints Mortis and tenon, tongue groove, dovetail, rabbit. Okay. Uh, I need glasses. Is this, is this hard to read? N- I knew none of those words. Okay. You never have a dovetail joint? Tongue and groove because it's the easiest to install. Ooh. Dovetail because it's the prettiest. That's second. Uh, mortis and tenon because I've uh, that's like used in a lot of uh, timber framing, which I've always wanted to learn, but I never got to learn. And then uh, the last one is rabbit because you never need that ever. All right. This is sort of little carpentry. Also, stop reading Anne Rand. She is a bad writer. And well, libertarianism is gay. Anne Rand. Oh, is Anne Rand a person? Anne yeah. Rand McNally? Oh, Anne Rand oh. is a famous libertarian. Shout oh. out all the libertarians out there. Sons of Liberty. Ooh, I'm with Dave you, Smith. Dave Smith, could we coming for you, Are baby? Are you a libertarian? I'm, I'm, you I'm, cannot tell me this. Do you know my thing? I only I exclusively fuck libertarians. We're gonna have sex. Turn off the lights. Oh, All yeah? of them. Everyone, you really? I really have been with a lot of libertarians. Interesting. It's a mental illness. Well, I don't vote, so I don't know where that fits. In. Yeah, we're voting for fucking Dave Smith, though, <laughs> we're voting baby. For Dave Smith, we're voting for fucking Dave Smith. Yo. I'm a fucking libertarian now, guys. <laughs> he goes, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love all that shit. Ron Paul and stuff. Yeah. Oh, uh, Ron Paul is my one of my heroes. Dude. That's an. I got a Ron fact. Paul tattoo. Uh, yeah, but we're all gonna vote for Dave Smith. So everyone in New York is gonna be a libertarian soon. There's no way we're not voting for Dave Smith. Like if he ran for president, you know Dave Smith. Who's Dave Smith? From Legion of Skanks. Oh, oh, Dave Smith, comedy Dave Smith. Yeah, he's yes. gonna he's gonna run as the leader of the Libertarian Party soon, and then when he does, are you that, serious? He's gonna run for president. Yes. And what? When he runs for president, we're all gonna vote for him. Did Ron Paul just stop my, running altogether? Something like that. Yeah, he just couldn't get get in there. He's too old, is he? After two thousand eight, I think they they kind of pushed him out. I also don't vote. I'm in the doghouse with all of my. No, friends. no one votes, but we will vote for our friend David. All right. Of course. When we vote for our friend David, no one actually votes. That's a crazy thing. This is a that's a, people really do vote. No, they dude, just get, I have they, friends outside just of comedy, them. and it's like crazy. I sell the stickers outside the voting booth and just like save yourself the time. Here you go, fifty cent. I I think somebody just saw a celebrity do that, like wait in line for a long time, and then they just took the sticker and left. It was a Kirby enthusiasm episode, but yes, <laughs> no, 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 it happened, <laughs> in, real <laughs> happened in real life. <laughs> they just saw it. It was somebody. It was one of the comedians saw. Oh, I forget who it was. I'll find out. I'll report back. Yeah, please do. Jordan Jensen, friend of the show. Thank you so much for coming on. I'm sorry the room me. was so hot. Um, yo, check out all our stuff and go see your live. Very funny comedian. Good night.